Hello everybody! Oops! How is everybody tonight? Mm, I'm just posting my links real quick here. Hope everybody is doing well. Uh, my mute should not be on. <clears throat> Hopefully y'all can hear me. Hopefully. I will check my stream real quick. Totoro, thank you for the follow. So, let me just finish posting my links real quick and then we'll get into it. <coughs> Pardon me. So nice. Sphere added me to the live streamers list. That's so nice. Alright, so we are going to continue working on this challenge. I kind of messed up this house a little bit, but <laughs> what can you do? I'm already so far, I'm not going to fix it. However, if I complete this house, or I should say townhouse, and I still don't like it I'll, I'll just strip it all the way down like I'll save it to the gallery and then I will just start over so far this is what it looks like um, ignore this this is just for windows up here at the moment to let light in because it's a, it's a little dark upstairs it's just a little bit dark so this is technically one lot but there are three townhouses here so we are going to be um yeah we're gonna be whoops making this three uh like townhouses i got the idea from looking at uh the brownstone townhouses but there's no real nice brownstone on sims so this is what we're going for. Ah, oh, Bev, thank you. Good morning. You you've been sharing such gorgeous food. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> yeah, dinner was delicious. Albeit, I shouldn't have eaten at uh, like 2 a.m. My dinner. <laughs> but yeah, it was delicious. Um, I'm doing really good. I well, I ate super late because I haven't been able to sleep much in the past like 
three days, so everything's a little messed up right now. So I, I tried to sleep earlier and I couldn't. And yeah, so now here I am streaming, but I'm I'm doing good. Just a little tired, <laughs> a little tired, but that's okay. Uh, how are you doing? How are you? Yes. So right now, uh, I'm just mm, a little annoyed with this, but that's okay. I'm gonna f try to fix it as best as I can. Uh, yeah. So I was working on the inside here. Uh, trying to decide on the basement floor what kind of door I want for the little washroom here. So this is a build challenge for Sims Grown and it needs to be under $200,000 and so far we're only at thirty-five, so that's not too bad. Um, so yeah, so I'm just thinking... I'm thinking this will be, well obviously the entryway, and I was thinking about putting those dream home decorator like hanging closet thing here, and then I'm putting like a mirror, and then I was debating, because this is going to be like the living room area, and this wall cannot have windows obviously, but this can, so I was thinking of putting like a TV on this wall, and putting like a couch or a couple chairs or something here and then I was thinking about making like a computer here putting a computer here and then having like a little seating area to like put on your shoes and kind of stuff you know and this is our little like uh, two-piece bathroom just gonna have toilet and sink here and then upstairs we'll have a bigger bathroom with shower and tub probably and then this is gonna be the kitchen area um, I was debating putting the kitchen actually here, like starting it here in the hallway and just running it along this wall and then this will be the dining area. We'll see though. I, I might make this L the kitchen. I'm not entirely sure. I just figured if we did the kitchen here, then it's like kind of like a galley kitchen in the way that it's, you know, kind of walk through and you can put cupboards on the wall. But here we can have windows and I kind of wanted to take advantage of that so I'm undecided at the moment uh, I do hope you managed to get some good rest soon oh thank you yeah me too I'm hoping after this stream I'll be able to go to sleep <laughs> um, you're doing good just a little tired a bit frantic this morning rebuilding some of Mrs. Sim's shell oh no you're s oh, I hate it when the saves get messed up that is the freaking worst, isn't it? Oh my gosh, I can't tell you how many times I've been working on a shell and my save gets messed up or it doesn't save at all and I'm like, are, are, are you kidding? Are you kidding me right now? <laughs> it's so sad. So I feel you, I feel you on that. I'm so sorry that that happened, that sucks. Absolutely sucks. Hmm. Well, hopefully you're able to rebuild it soon. When is the shell due? I haven't I haven't really working on any shells just cuz I I've been failing at them as in like not turning them in in time cuz there never seems to be enough time to do it. I do like doing them though. I just I never think well, I don't know. I I it's just usually when people give a time frame it's like two weeks and I'm like I have life and mental health issues I can't do it in two weeks help <laughs> also Sean hello welcome in hello hello it kills you oh my gosh my twitch just decided to I don't know do something weird there for a sec I I'm surprised to see you awake uh, Sean, right now. <laughs> to be perfectly honest with you. I am totally surprised to see you awake. Oh my god, I have no idea what color to do in here. I don't really like taupe or like these types of colors. Maybe like white. Maybe I'll just do white. 
it kills you. Sims is just so buggy. Ugh, I know, right? I know. It's super annoying. It's very annoying when that happens. Hmm. This is gray. This is like purple. It's kind of too dark. You went to bed early? Ugh, I tried. <laughs> it didn't work for me, obviously. I literally tried to go to bed at like 7 p.m. And I laid in bed for two hours doing nothing. And I was like, okay. Well, that's not working. <laughs> so I'm up now. Now nah, I've been up pretty much the whole time. Uh, a shell is like when somebody builds... Okay, so basically, imagine this entire building completely unfinished. And all you see are the walls, both inside and outside. And sometimes inside they don't even have walls, it's just the outside. <laughs> <coughs> I'm sorry about that. <coughs> sometimes it's literally just the outside, and then you're allowed to put walls wherever you want. Um, sometimes it's like the builder does the entire inside and outside, and the only thing you're allowed to do is like kind of furnish it and decorate it however you want. Just depends on the type of shell. Uh, oh, you woke up at 1am. Uh, that's not bad though. Oh no, it's due tomorrow. The shell is due tomorrow. Though I've been doing so many recently, it's kind of hard to remember dates for each. Oh gosh, yeah, I would absolutely need to write that down. Oh my god, I couldn't imagine. I tried doing three at once, and I was like, no. <laughs> I burnt myself out. Nope, not happening. Nope. <laughs> so, yeah. I stopped doing that after. <laughs> okay, you know what I should do? I'm gonna just, uh, okay, so I should just build the walls in every single thing and then I can just take the exact same items, albeit different colors, and do the same thing in every suite, unless we want it to look a little different, but for now, I'm just gonna do that. I mean, the doors are all on the same side of the house, so why not? Also, I'm undecided if I want to leave this stairway open with a railing and just put a computer desk like here, or if I want this to be a legit wall. I haven't quite decided yet. Uh, you had to ditch out... You had to ditch out early of your Traveler game because my eyes were drifting closed. Aww, well... Hopefully, well, wait, is it like a game you can save? Or is it like something you cannot save? Because I guess you could just continue it later if it's not something you have to save. Ah, uh, Cool Kids Lit, hello! How are you doing? What stairs are these? I don't know. So I'm just gonna copy them. Copy. Or legit. <laughs> I thought about doing these like just the lengthways, like just one way. But then I was like, where am I going to put the bathroom? So I figured I would just do it this way and then make the bathroom right in the, the center of it kind of thing. Because then it's still in the middle of the house, but also out of the way. You know? Kingdom, hi! Uh... <laughs> Sorry, you straight up decided already that the one you've started isn't going in time. It's just too much. My kid needs me too, not just my sims. <laughs> yeah. Yep, yep, your kid kind of needs you. <laughs> That's kind of important. <laughs> Hashtag priorities, am I right? <laughs> no, I know. I know what you mean though. It's a nice little escape though from real life once in a while, right? It's allowed. It's allowed. I'm not entirely sure if this is gonna be like the bedroom in each. I might change the layout upstairs, but for now I'm just kinda doing this. For now, I'm just doing this. Also, I have BB move objects on, so 
I might have to adjust where, like, the stairs and stuff, because Sims are really dumb sometimes. They're like, I can't get up the stairs, even though they have room. They're just really dumb. <laughs> Tasha, you're here as well. Good morning. Cool Kids Lit, you're just chilling, playing The Sims. Yes, so am I. I feel ya. So many Simmers here. I love it. Also, Lily, you were talking to your mom? I wished her happy birthday earlier. Like, I sent her a message on Facebook. How is she doing? Uh, it's still early for me, so I'm going back to sleep for a bit. I've got your stream up. Thank you so much, hon. Hope you have a good rest of your sleep. I'll see you later. Enjoy the lions, yes. No, that's okay that you didn't respond, Lily. Totally fine. I was just letting you know in case you wanted to come hang out for a little bit after. Uh, did I make a wall here? No. No, I did not. We are working on, for those of you who just showed up, making a townhouse. Oh, by the way, these cars, all I did was I took the, these are like the collector item like cars, like the little toys, and I just made them big. That's all I did. <laughs> so they kind of look like they're parked cars, which I like. Not entirely sure I like these awnings though, but we'll see. I do like that it takes away the flat surface, uh, but it's because I screwed this house up after I already got too far where I would have to adjust like the roof and everything, and I'm not a good roofer, so I kind of didn't want to. Um, oh, hold on. Tabletop game with other people play over voice chat. Oh, okay. It's not through Tabletop Simulator, right, Sean? It's like actually a game where you just play over voice chat? That's still cool. Um, you're now playing some Pathfinder Kingmaker now that found some good RPG after such a long time. Yeah. I know, it's hard to find a really good game, right? <coughs> I haven't played it, but from the- I did watch the YouTube video you sent, and so I kinda, like, that's totally something that I would play as well. So I kinda wanna try it out if it's- I'm not sure how much it costs or anything, but it's worth trying. Uh, what wall did I put here? Was it 1.25? Yep, okay. It was 1.25. Okay, good. Can't see the stairs. There we go. Boop. Okay. This house is so out of my comfort zone, you guys. Like or houses, I should say, are so out of my comfort zone because it's so tiny and so narrow. It's so tiny. Like, I'm used to making this one giant ass house and like having like four rooms on the top and like open concept area on the bottom except for a bathroom. <laughs> so yeah, this is really small for me to be working with. I'm looking forward to this challenge. I didn't have to go with this, I could have done something different, but I liked the idea of making townhouses for this challenge, so. That's what I went with. Should probably add some lights down here. I haven't added lights in this house yet. There we go. Add one there. Oh, my kitty is snoring, you guys. She's so cute. Lulu. She's snoring. Uh. Play over Discord and roll dice. Oh, okay. <clears throat> I haven't actually played a, like, a real life board game over Discord before. You could totally do it, though. 
I don't see why you couldn't. Um, Pathfinder, Kingmaker, burnt me out near the end, played a... Uh, what? How do you say that? Kinet... Oh my Jesus, I'm not even gonna try. Pathfinder, Wrath of the Righteous is also out, apparently it's really good. Um, It's helping me recover from the torment of Pillars of Eternity. So that's what makes it good so far. <clears throat> Man, I have never played this game. It sounds like almost everybody in stream here has played this game before. I have not. I have not. Okay, what y'all think of this layout so far? I mean, it's the same in every house, but I mean, it is a townhouse. They're gonna look the exact same. I'm not sure. Like, I need to add a bathroom up here. And it's gonna be like a big bathroom. So, I'm not sure... We need at least two bedrooms. I think what I need to do is put like a bed in the rooms to see how big I need the bedrooms to be. And then see much how much space we have. Cause like technically this could just be the hallway right here. And then this could just be the bathroom and this could be a smaller bedroom. And this could be a slightly larger bedroom. But, uh, uh, you know, I kind of wanted to make the bedrooms similar in size, and this one is like six, and this is only four. <clears throat> I guess I could move the stairs. But no, actually, no, I don't want to, because this is a living room. Although I could. I could. It's not going to be the end of the world if I do. <laughs> I'm sorry for coughing, you guys. It sounds a hell of a lot better than me muting the mic, so bear with me. Um, I'm just reading chat. Um, that's cool. Lighting all the enemies around you on fire. Yeah. I'm pretty sure many here haven't played this Pathfinder. Uh, are you sure about that? There's a lot of people in chat. Oh, stream elements. I mean, what are people's thoughts on second edition? I have no thoughts. I am brainless. <laughs> I mean, when it comes to this. <laughs> okay, we're gonna leave it like that, I guess. Um. <clears throat> okay, what are your thoughts, since there's some other simmers in this chat. What are your thoughts on the sliding door for the bathroom? What are your thoughts on this? I like the black and white and it's like chevron-ish pattern, but I'm unsure if it's going to interfere. As you can see, it takes up two squares on either side of the wall. So I'm worried if I put like the sink here and the toilet here, if it's going to interfere. Like if Sims are going to be able to like use it okay or not. Ugh. My legs, oh, they're sore. Um, yeah, okay. So now, I'm not sure about wall color. We'll come back to that in a little bit. Let's change the time of day, because this is like, yeah, that's better. It's kind of bright. Okay, that's better. Now I can actually see you without it being like overly bright. Um, dream home decorator. You mean, it would be nice if they didn't set CRs, CRs based on everyone making absolute... Jesus, I can't read right now. Uh, optimized builds possible, rendering every similar... Oh, jeez. 
see our encounter into a boss fight for anyone new to the system or even who wants to roleplay. <clears throat> Pardon me. Thank you for the follow on PlayStation. I don't think Pillars of Eternity's heaviness was the problem for me, it's more the lack of story. CR is combat rating. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm like, I have no idea, thank you. <laughs> uh, okay, Dream Home Decorator. Uh, it's as satisfying as a picture of a buffet. A lot of teasing, but you can't taste anything. A lot of interesting characters with no plot and tons of references to story that didn't actually happen in game. It's like high quality ingredients given to a terrible chef. The waste of potential is painful. <clears throat> oh boy. Don't you love when that happens? Uh, okay, so... Dream home decorator... Where art thou? Um, where's the thing in my bobber? Oh yeah, curtains! Right! <laughs> curtains! <laughs> the thing I never use. Yeah, I never use curtains. Could you like, let me? These are cute. I'm gonna put curtains here just to remind me to use curtains because if I don't, <laughs> I will legitimately forget. <coughs> Pardon me. Um, where's the, like, dresser they can put, like, shoes in? Um, so confused. Yeah, I'll need this as well. Hmm, wood? Maybe just white. Just put it in here. It's just gonna be white. <clears throat> I need to find the... Where is it? Oh, there it is. Should I put that there, or... Or just one of those... Things with the pre-built-in shoes. If I put this here... Uh, here, let me catch up on chat real quick. Cause there's a lot going on. That's the complete opposite of my experience with it. You love the story so much than more than Pathfinder Kingmaker for the most part. <clears throat> yeah, lack of story. No sounds strange, but that's really the problem with it. Um <clears throat> You got a bit butthurt when it was announced because my new character was basically null and void. Think the first edition still has a lot of growth to come with Starfinder. As well, they've kind of jumped the gun on the second. <clears throat> it will take an essay to explain why the story was lacking. Fair enough. I mean, everybody has different experience, right? So it makes sense. Uh, why is my joystick not working? Duh. Oh no! Oh no! Shit! You guys, I should have closed Sims before streaming. No, it's all messed up. <laughs> Dang it. I'll just have to be nice to it. I mean, I thought I had an amazing story. You were trying to save an entire generation of children while unraveling the mysteries of the gods. There's a lot of events, there's history, there's backstories, but really all the interesting happened, or stuff happened behind the scenes and before the actual game. So lots of good setup but no real plot, just a teaser of the story that we'll never experience. That sucks. I don't like it when games and movies and stuff do that. The drawers are cute there. Okay, cool, thank you. So we'll leave that there. We'll just put some shoes on them. 
And we'll add some little the modular thingies to put shoes in as well. Where are those little boxes? There they are. Do, do, do. Okay. And we're gonna bring this down. Oh, it's very tall. Well, we could add more of those up top. Sometime today? Perfect. There. Oops. <laughs> I know if I do this though, it'll clip through the freaking wall, which... I don't get that. So I can't put anything else there. <sighs> okay, so we can hang up some clothing here. This will be like our little like ooh, um, closet, you know, like when you walk in, put all your stuff in. Um, clothing. Okay, so here's our shoes. Shoesies. Aha, here's the clothing. Oh wait, no, I want this one. This one. Hat. There we go. Because I like to be able to see the hat there. Um, we could also put a backpack. I think that's in the kids' stuff. I can't remember exactly. Okay, so we have some shoes. I don't know about you, but who stores their shoes like this? I don't know. I always store my shoes like this so I can grab them, but I guess if you want to see what they look like, you would store them like that. I guess for this, we'll do this. Lily! Um... As I said, there's a lot of potential and real cool concepts, which is why I stuck to it for so long. But I lost my steam after maybe 30 hours? That is a long time. You've had, a, you had enough teasers for 30 hours. <laughs> to be honest, I'm pretty much done with the system mechanically. There are far too many flaws in it that become way more apparent when you play other RPGs. So I like that they changed up the formula. Uh, the three actions per round really changes how you play true strike is useful for the first time ever. From my point of view, it's direct mechanical upgrade to Pathfinder slash 3.5. The only problem right now is it doesn't have all the classes converted. You're gonna go now? Okay, Lil, have a good night. We'll talk to you later. Maybe we were supposed to try a remnant today and I totally forgot about it. We, could, we can test it tomorrow. Have a good night. I think... You store items like that if they're more for looks. Yeah, I was I was thinking that too, but also <coughs> maybe to see whose shoes they are? Question mark. I would just assume that people would have their own like little cubbies. You know, maybe I'll move these drawers, like completely remove them and just do the cubbies. Hmm. Sims are only about this tall, so like this is gonna be really high for them. Kind of doesn't make sense. So if I like remove these and put the these here, kind of makes more sense if I do it that way, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah, but four. Shoes. Oh my lord. Where was I going? Going for a ride. Okay. I don't know what to put up here. Maybe like a plant or something. Who knows? Maybe I'll just do that. I don't know. I'll leave this here just in case. Uh, yeah, I guess from the back they'd all look the same. Yeah. I don't know, I'm kind of torn on it myself. Mm. 
I like having like a really tall house like this is medium sized walls I love it <coughs> but like what the heck do I put up here <laughs> what the do I put up here hmm I guess we shall find out Well, I don't know, maybe... I don't know what color the wall is going to be right now. But... I do know. We need a mirror. Oops. <clears throat> Pardon me. Okay, so I want the rest of the shoes that they have here. I want to put them here, because this is going to be like a two, two, maybe even a three bedroom. I'm not quite sure yet. So we're going to have like multiple people's things here. Ah, why does it do that? What does that clip do? That's weird. That's a very strange. Hold on. I can't zoom in anymore. Why is that? Okay, now they're fine. That was weird. Um, <clears throat> I could move this down more. I don't, I don't know. Maybe I could put some more stuff up here and then just like put storagey type stuff up there because like in clothing closets like this you usually might have something for like different seasons or something like that we'll see um oh right i can make my own sectionals <gasps> i should do that <coughs> Hi, baby. Kitty is staring at me. She's like, huh? Hello, human. Hello, human. Give me love and affection. I gave you love and affection earlier. That's fair. Preach about... Uh... About the fucking truce strike when we get 3.5. Ow, Lulu. Ow. Your claws are sharp. I'll probably be there for a bit, but my head's too full of poop to take in a second while well, I was caught up playing in first so much. Man, I got bloodlines to live out. Can't stop me yet! <laughs> Can't stop you yet! Nope, siree! Hmm. One. We could probably do two of these here. Well, I should at least put one. Uh, and then maybe like two more of these. I can't do any more than that. Okay. Now, I wonder if we have like hats at all. Just a hat. Just a random ass hat. Because I was thinking like, oh, we have backpacks. I wonder if we have hats. God dang it. Would this fit up here? Oh my god! Uh, very... Oh. Ah, I could put boxes on top. I could do that. Yeah, the bigger boxes on top. Hmm. Kind of like a hat box. Do we have like. I know we have snowboard type stuff, but I don't think it's stuff that can go on the shelf. Um. Oh, 
Oh god, I don't want to go out. There we go. <coughs> Pardon me. That seems super cramped, doesn't it? I think maybe it's too much storage. Maybe. Maybe. God dang it. Um. Oh, these are actual bins. Whoa. Oh, they have like stuff in them. Interesting. Okay. I haven't seen those. I didn't actually really pay attention to those bins. Cause I like the cloth one, like the look of the cloth ones better. <clears throat> hmm. Oh lord. There we go. Well, I'm gonna see... Oh, I should probably take it off of... Dream Home Decorator. Oh, yeah, actually, let's click on... Snowy Escape. Oh yeah, Spa Day. And Snowy Escape. Uh, Sean, you're gonna head off for... Uh, try to... Gonna head off and try to go to bed. Alright, sounds good. I hope you're able to get some more sleep. That way you don't have to stay up like super duper late, you know, and then sleep super early tomorrow. But thanks for coming by and hanging out for a bit. I appreciate it. I'll talk to you later. Oh, pardon me. Yeah, we have skateboards, <clears throat> or sorry, skis and things. Um... Trying to look for stuff that we could potentially store in here. Actually, I really like this for keys. Is this for keys? No. It's for support stuff. Can they just give us one of these tiny little ones <clears throat> for keys? Like, that would be great. Because I absolutely love those. And there's this has more, like, stuff. Yes, good night, Sean. Have a good night. Cookies! Hello! How are you doing, hun? How are you? What's this? Oh, it's a rack for all the sports equipment. <coughs> you guys, I'm so sorry for coughing in your ear. Paper lanterns! Oh my god, I love these. One day I'm gonna make a home in Mount Corombi or however the heck you say that. Love all the stuff from Snowy Escape. Cookies, cookies, hi! I was looking for stuff that we could store in there, but I don't really see anything. Oh no! Got your second jab! Been feeling the side effects. That's not good. Hmm, I heard if you massage your arm it will help. Hopefully tomorrow I'm gonna start crocheting. Oh, that's awesome. I wish I knew how to crochet. <clears throat> Did I just say crochet? Crochet? Oh my god. <laughs> crochet. Um, yeah, I'm good. I'm just tired, but I couldn't sleep, so here I am. Here I am. <sighs> yep, we're just chilling. I'm good though. Haven't been able to sleep in like three days. So I'm like super overtired right now. You know what I wish we could do with these? I wish we could store these rolled up like this. That would be freaking awesome. The yoga mats. Hmm. 
Um, excuse me, where's my bench? Oh, no mind. <laughs> I'm dumb. I passed it. I like this for like an entryway bench. Uh, although I'm not sure if this is gonna really fit my vibe of this house. <clears throat> We'll put it there, we'll take a look at some others, if we need to. Okay, well I didn't see anything to store up here. Crocheting. So cookies, what are you going to start crocheting? I'm so curious. Hat. <coughs> Pardon me. The rabbit's hat. What? What is this? Uh. Ah! Mm. What is this? Actually, a poor rabbit's home that has been turned upside down. Some considerate soul laid down a flower as a sign of respect. No idea what the party horn is for, though. Why is this part of Seasons? Ooh, rainbow hat. Oh my god, that's so cute. I mean, we could store this in here. <laughs> uh, if it would go in there. Oh, I'd have to control that. Mm. Stupid analog stick. You're gonna make a fat bee. Oh my god, that sounds adorable. Uh, excuse me? Fat B for the win! <clears throat> oh my god, this is so annoying. Eee! Okay. Can I store that like right? Sure, I guess. Ooh, there's a Halloween-y looking one. Ooh, it's a fall one. <clears throat> Two hats, should we do it? No. <laughs> um Right, man, you have to do yoga in your kitchen of all places. Can't leave them at down all day. Ugh. In your kitchen? That sucks. I don't like doing... Well, I don't do yoga anyways, but I wouldn't like doing it in my kitchen if I was doing yoga. I still don't get what this hat is for. Like, doesn't tell you what it's for, but there's different seasons on it. Like, here's one for Halloween. I'm guessing the the that one is for Pride. One of these is for New Year's. Christmas. Valentine's Day. I don't know what the heck these hats are for, you guys. Birthday. Okay, where's the just plain black one? I thought we... Nope, okay. Well, I guess we're going with this one then. <clears throat> we're just gonna put two hats on these shelves, because why not? Clutter. My analog stick, however, doesn't really want to be my friend today. Guess they're decoration. <laughs> yeah, it definitely looks like that. <laughs> Holy moly. Oh my god. There we go. Okay. Oh! Stop it, analog stick! Work with me! There we go. Ah, look. Beautiful hats. Costume hats is more like it. <coughs> Pardon me. Rico! Good morning. How are you doing? Good to see you. But the bee is your starter. You also bought a book on various animals. Oh, that's so cute. 
Oh, I love Ellie B's little emotes. They're so freaking cute. Ugh, I wish I had a job so that I could literally subscribe to everybody that I care about because everybody has such wonderful emotes and I'm like obsessed with them. <sighs> yep, chugging water is good for the soul. Well, maybe not chugging it, but at least drinking it's good for the soul. Mm -hmm. Maybe, I don't know what color we're doing the walls yet, which is why I left this white, but I'm wondering if we should make them brown. I'm still coughing, yes. I think it's allergens, honestly, in my house, so I asked a friend if I could, well actually if they could come and shampoo my carpets for me. So uh, he said yes, so hopefully he'll be able to, I don't know, sometime soon. Probably not this coming weekend, but probably the next weekend after that. I'm pretty sure it's just allergens like dust and stuff getting to me because my cat also has asthma and she's coughing a lot. So I'm pretty sure it's because I've lived in this basement suite for three years and the carpet has never been shampooed except for before I moved in. <coughs> so I'm fairly certain that that is the reason but I'm not entirely sure. No, I'm not allergic to cats or cat uh, cat hair or any of that, but I am allergic to dust, and I'm allergic to pollen, and uh, well, right outside my window I have tons of, uh, well it's a giant park basically right outside my living room window. There's tons and tons of trees, lots of plants, lots of pollen, it's worse in spring though. Uh, I guess I, it would be under show all. I can never find ottomans or whatever they're called. I always have to search them. Yeah, I'm definitely allergic to dust though. And my place is very dusty. Oh, yeah, this is what I was looking for. Maybe this one would be better. Hmm. Or this one. I don't know. I like them all. Okay, not this one. It's one of these two. I'm thinking this. Uh, yeah, I mean, I like that. Or this. I'm not entirely sure. <clears throat> Ice Stella and Maple. <laughs> Good morning. Hello. Welcome in, everybody. How are you doing? <laughs> Good to see you all. I just happen to be streaming at this time of the day, and everyone seems to be arriving, which is really funny. <laughs> so, good morning, everybody. Is that CC? Nope, it is not. Uh, this current one, this is from City Living, pretty sure. And this one is from, oh god, what's that one called? Oh, I can't, I can't remember. Hold on, let me look at my packs and I can tell you. Island Living, yeah, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Let me show you what we're making. We are making <clears throat> townhouses for build Newcrest challenge. I cannot use CC because I'm on the PlayStation, so. Remember? Ducky, it's actually 9.07 AM for me. <sighs> yes. Yes, that's right, you are later. I Stella, you're also later in the day. I kind of messed up the house a little bit. Uh, this door should have been right on the edge. Like it should have been right here. And then everything should have been one over. So like this door should have been here. 
and that should have been there. But if I if it still bugs me, then I'm going to like move it. I'm gonna save this to the gallery and then I'm gonna redo it. Basically strip it down to nothing on the outside and kinda shuffle everything over. And this is the back. You like it like this? Yeah, I think it's just because I was modeling it after like some brownstone towns townhouses that are local here. I think it's probably why it was uh, bugging me a little bit. <laughs> because I was like, I did it wrong! But oh well. Also, these doors are not staying here. They're just here for window right now. Uh, just to bring in some light up here. I'm going to put windows here, actually. I haven't decided if I was going to put like balconies out here up top for these bedrooms. Or like those faux balconies that are here at the front. I haven't quite decided yet. Everyone here's pretty much from a different time zone than me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Midday, 9.09 a.m. Yep. Y'all are pretty much in the same time zones. It's because it's 4.10 a.m. for me. So, <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, God. So, yeah. So, I'm just working on... <clears throat> Figuring out... I'm pretty sure I have the layout for the house. I just, I'm not sure about up here. I still have to figure out the big bathroom. You know what I thought about doing to you guys? I'm not sure if y'all would agree. But making this a bathroom where both bedrooms have a door coming into it. You know, it's kind of... What do you call those bathrooms? I can't remember the name. Uh, I can't remember, but you know what I'm talking about. Where both bedrooms have access to the bathroom, and then instead of putting the door in the hallway, you're just going to use the two doors from the bedroom. <clears throat> oh, it's Jack and Jill. Is that what it's called? Jack and Jill bathroom? I'm pretty sure that's what it's called. Uh, but yeah, so I'm thinking about doing that. Because then both of these bedrooms will have direct access and I don't have to put three doors in this tiny little hallway. Eh, I think that might be the way to do it. Ah, uh, shoot, I'm so sorry. Uh, we can't do sound alerts because I'm streaming from PlayStation. I thought I disabled them for the stream, but obviously I did not. So I'll... I don't know if I can refund you for that. Hold on. Let me check. I'm not entirely sure if I can. That being said, let me also go turn those off. Cause I don't want you guys wasting your points. Sorry about that. Uh, when I stream from my laptop, you'll definitely be able to use the sound alerts. When you were younger, you always loved Sims, but I didn't have enough money. Oh, yeah. I mean... I feel that. I still don't have a lot of money in an adult, so. <laughs> uh, yeah, let me go disable these real quick. <coughs> Pardon me. Disable, disable, disable. Yes. Damn good coffee. Uh, just checking if that's all the sound alerts. Yes, okay. There you go. They should be disabled now. <laughs> you should save money, but Sims. Ah, uh, I'm so sorry about that, Beth. I wish I could give you those points back, but it doesn't look like I can. And also hydrate. Well, I have hot chocolate here. Does that count for hydration? Hmm. I guess it kind of does. Woof. Woof woof. As in dog, or you were saying woof to something else. I never played Sims until I was, uh, well, last year. <laughs> until last year. But yeah, Sims is expensive. Uh, I was gratefully uh, gifted a lot of packs. 
I shouldn't say a lot. Like, a few. And then I purchased the rest on sale when I got my Twitch money for the first time. Hmm. I feel like this is better suited in like a bedroom. So yeah, I kind of like purchased themselves for my uh, for my Twitch monies. My very first Twitch check. <clears throat> I didn't really want black here, but black will probably go okay. So okay, so let's pick the floor. I still need to pick what flooring I want here. I also don't like these railings, but there's no other better one, so that's fine. Uh, okay, so I might put black flooring in front of the door. Also, do you guys like this sliding door for the bathroom? <clears throat> this barn door? I'm just concerned about Sims being silly and not being able to use the sink or the toilet. If, like, I put the sink and the toilet here, is this door gonna interfere? <coughs> Pardon me. Sorry about that. Um, I should save money, but Sims! Sims is too expensive, yeah. You started playing Sims like six to seven years ago? Well, when it first came out it was like 2000 is what I was talking to somebody in my chat the other day about. I was 10 when it first came out in 2000. And I watched my cousin play a little bit of the very first Sims game. But I never actually got to try it myself. Um, so... Well, I did play a little bit actually, that's a lie. But it really wasn't like full on play. It was like, oh, you know, half an hour of doing whatever, you know, with my cousin. So it wasn't like I got to actually play it, you know? Okay. I need dark floors. Hmm. Uh, maybe not dark floors, actually. Also, could you like herringbone? I love herringbone. Oh, I want it to run the other way, though. Okay, never mind. Too fancy for this. Too fancy for this place. Okay, what about this floor? This is kind of nice. Hold on. I know it's the basketball floor. But gray? With white walls? Thoughts? Or, oh no, this is the granite falls wood flooring. Oh, I like the rustic look. I was kind of going for a more chic look. Where's the basketball floor? Yeah, this one. Yeah, this one. This is the one I was thinking of, sorry. Super duper shiny. I think I'd run it the other way, like the length ways though. <clears throat> so if you look at the whole floor like this, it runs the short way, which I don't really like because it makes the room feel small. But if you do this, okay, um, we're probably gonna change, or maybe not change it up in the living room, but or sorry, we're the dining room and the kitchen. Probably just gonna do it run the whole way. See? Makes it look much nicer. Cause it runs the long way instead. <coughs> also, it matches the gray on this door, which I totally like. I'm honestly thinking like walls that are white. The kitchen will do like a colored backsplash and then obviously we can add art and stuff to the wall. I will be adding art from the gallery, not CC art, but like art that Hoot of the Sims has done because she has some really amazing stuff. Really amazing stuff. Okay, not plaster. Sorry, I've kind of missed some chat, I think. Yeah, I totally did. Uh, Beth, you said, because not anyone should ever illegally download anything. 
if anyone is shorter on funds and still wants to game things, maybe check out CD keys. Find all sorts on there. True. True, you could totally do that. And also, I've totally <laughs> illegally downloaded stuff before. Mainly when I was younger. <laughs> <coughs> Shit. Sorry, guys. Hmm. You did play Sims Mobile when you were little, but I was bored already. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I can't- I've never heard of Sims Mobile, but I, I can imagine it's probably not as fun as, like, the actual computer game. Looks nice. Okay. So maybe I'll use this floor then. Uh, you've been cooped up in quarantine and tomorrow's the last day of online school, so I get school holidays. Heck yes! School holidays already? I mean, okay, I shouldn't say already because it's like, <clears throat> here, it's like school was just starting. Hey, I never thought about wallpaper. What about wallpaper? Wallpaper? Is this kind of pretentious or does it kind of look nice? Probably not on the same walls as the windows though. Kind of looks pretentious. This could be like the living room wall. Hold on. I can't see anything, it's too bright. Ah, yes, much better. <laughs> so, super shiny floor, and we're gonna put some rug. rugs. rugs down. By the way, this curtain is not staying here like this. It's, uh. It's just here to remind me to use curtains. Yep. Because I am terrible at that. Hmm. I feel like this needs to be colored now. <coughs> Shh, we're good little beans in here. Shh. That pesky wabbit. <laughs> yeah, don't tell anybody. Don't tell anybody. I mean, what were you even doing with your life in the early 2000s if you didn't rip games and movies and music off? <laughs> Am I right? <laughs> okay, is that too much brown? Like, ugh. It feels too dark. This closet is supposed to be light. Okay, what about... Okay, let's take a look at the white with the... Mm. Go. Uh, I can't tell what one this is supposed to be. Gonna get some soda. Bring me back a soda. Oops, not that one. Oh yeah, actually, should it be like brown on the outside with white on the inside? Like that, maybe? To kind of give it some color. Do I have a black and white one? Ah, we have black and white. Well, we could do black and white. I mean, it does kind of add some color, which is nice. <coughs> Shoot, I'm so sorry, guys. I hate coughing in your ears. Would you steal a car? Would you steal a handbag? Those adverts killed me. It's like, no, I fucking wouldn't, but like... <laughs> you know, when you're a poor ass kid and your parents are broke, like, what are you supposed to do, homie? <laughs> Just go without? Yeah, I guess. You know what? I lucked out when I was a teenager. I found an iPod on the ground and I tried to return it to the person. It was a girl who went to my school. And I tried to return it to her, and she's like, no, it's okay, you can keep it, because my dad bought me a brand new one. I was like, what? Excuse me? Are you sure? She's like, yeah, thanks for trying to return it, but it's okay, I have a brand new one. And this iPod was only like three months old at that point. And I was like, oh my god, okay, awesome, thank you. 
then she had to like get rid of her account off of it and then I like got to upload all my illegal music to it <laughs> so yeah that was pretty awesome uh, Maple you have to go to sleep I have fun okay well thank you for stopping in hun I appreciate it I'll see you soon take care take care uh, I almost said ducky I meant Maple well it's the same I guess <clears throat> yeah, I was surprised, honestly. Good little beans. <laughs> Are we though? <laughs> um. Oh, Tasha, I missed your comment. I'm so sorry. Good morning. You're officially awake now. How do you feel? I hope you're you feel well rested. You guys, I'm not sure about the colors of this. I think I need to do the walls and flooring first and then figure the rest out. And actually, I'm gonna get rid of these curtains. I'm also not sure about this color of the door, but I guess it's okay. <clears throat> Pardon me. For some reason, I feel hungover, even though I had I had a drink. <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah, I felt like that several times after waking up. I don't know why. Just overtired, maybe. Nope, not linoleum. Nope, not that. Is it? It is. Okay, let's add this here. Oh God. Well, I can't see shit, cause nighttime. <gasps> daytime, nighttime. Okay, does black go okay there, or should we make it light colored like the stairs? Hmm. Hmm. Uh. I think I'm still recovering from stream yesterday. Yes. That would make sense. Honestly, it would. You like the black? Yeah, I kind of do too, right? Because it adds a nice contrast. Also, thank you. Yes, it is super cute. <clears throat> I'm, I'm also debating on where to put these actual mailbo bleh, mailboxes, but for now, they can stay there. It's a fun. <coughs> Welcome to a fresh day. Yay! Um, I'm gonna be putting plants here actually. I'm getting rid of this. So what I was thinking was to put trash. So mailboxes are gonna be like up here somewhere. Either like this. Something like that. And then I'm gonna put trash either on this side or this side. I haven't decided. I think maybe to the left of the doors and then all in here is gonna be like some plants or something. Or I'll put a fence here with some plants and then one garbage bin here and one garbage bin here and the neighbors can share them. Kind of like in the middle. <clears throat> I haven't quite decided yet. Not 100% sure. This is uh, supposed to be a challenge. Oh, I'll read you guys the challenge actually. Here. It's on Sims Grown on Facebook. So we're this is chapter 7 of Build Newcrest. So it says, uh, when Felicity's morning walk around town, she realized, oh sorry, while, uh, she realized that there's no affordable housing for young newcomers. Uh, I must fix it. If I build it, they will come. So pick one or both. One, build apartment style housing with a minimum of three units on the Hillside Highlands lot with a budget of up to $200,000. Um, I'm not going to make The Sims because I, I spend way too much time in Cass. But I was like, okay, instead of doing an apartment, I'm going to do townhouses. And each townhouse is going to have two bedrooms, upstairs... Uh, one main bathroom with like a bath and shower and then like a half bath downstairs with the sliding door here This area is like the entrance walkway I'm Gonna put a computer desk here Living room and then this is gonna be like dining room and kitchen. I was thinking about putting the kitchen here <clears throat> And then each has their own 
So I just put this here for now. I'm actually going to put windows there. I haven't decided yet if I want to use like that faux balcony that's at the front of the house on the back as well. Um, or build an actual like room out here and then use that as like an actual balcony for them. I haven't decided yet. I'm thinking faux balcony just to be consistent with looks and then I'll just put some plants on it. For now these doors are just staying here to add light inside. And then yeah, we have our little balconies out here, so I'm gonna put like a little grill and a little patio and some more plants and that kind of thing. Also, I suck at roofing, but I'm quite happy with this. This is one of these long roofs stretched all the way from front to back. And then this is just one giant roof. Um, have you guys seen those townhouses that kind of look like, like they're they're on a hill so it's like one shorter than the other and then like one on the right is like the shortest the one in the middle is like medium height and one on the left is like the tallest I tried to do that but <laughs> and a big but is the foundation the foundation once you connect it makes it all the same height so what I tried to do was leave where the grass is here there was a space in between each building and I tried to connect the roofing like the roofing even like across all of them would not work so that was super disappointing because I had them all like different layered <coughs> it looked really cool too but like I tried to connect roofing and it didn't work and I was like okay well you know, I guess it makes sense because you can't really have a roof. Like, even when they were the same height, it wouldn't connect all the way across, which kind of sucked. But that's okay. So now they're all connected, which I didn't really want them to all be connected, but that's okay. So yeah, so now I'm just decorating the insides. They all look the exact same. Color schemes are going to be different though. Also, I'm still not sure. Okay, you guys tell me right now. Here. Okay. Let me paint the side of this real quick. Eee! Sorry, analog stick. It's going crazy. Okay, here. So, I was debating whether I should do railing and leave the railing open or if I should wall it off like what I had there. Um, I wasn't sure what railings to use so I wanted to keep kind of modern-ish. I was thinking about doing the same railings that are out here but I'm not really sure. We could try that. I wanted like the glass railings, like this one. Not that color though. Probably honestly just white. So I kind of wanted to keep it like that. Uh, where's the other one? Uh, there's another glass one. There it is. So it has like those. So basically when you walk in, you're going to be confronted by like this wall and it's going to show the stairs going up and then you're going to have your little seating area here, your umbrellas, we're going to have a little computer desk here, <coughs> pardon me, here, uh, let's see, let's show you. I'm not sure exactly what desk yet, but let's just go with this one for the hell of it. I was gonna put it right against this wall and put plants on either side. So basically like your computer is gonna be here, your chair is gonna be here, plant, <clears throat> plant, and then you're gonna have your little seating area, little walk-in area, that, something here, or <clears throat> or I was going to do it like this. 
Because if I do it like this, it's just too straight, like too flat on, you know? Um... Yeah. Could also put like a small bookshelf right here. It's kind of like a little office area. I just haven't quite decided like what I wanted, like which uh, layout I wanted for it. Oh, this is a big bookcase, but I like it. So nice. Anyways. Um, nope, that's way too big. This one. Could even do that. You know, this is supposed to be. Yeah, I think that's probably fine, to be honest. <coughs> oh my god, it's still so bright in here. There we go. <coughs> so when you walk in, stairs or wall? Should it be visible to the stairs or should it be a wall? That's- I'm very indecided- or undecided there. Totally not sure. I guess when you're coming down the stairs then at least you can see like if somebody's at the door. Maybe, but if it's walled off you can't see anything until you get down the stairs. I guess there's that. I don't know. Maybe let's try different railing and let's see how it looks. Uh, the railing I'm using outside, I think. No, it's definitely not that one. Um, honestly, I don't remember. Is it? Nope. Oh, okay, it's the one. It's a that one. No, not this one either. I can't remember! Is it this one? No. What the heck? That one kinda looks nice. Actually, I don't mind that one, but no. I'm trying to find the exact one I'm using and it's hard to tell because they're all white here. Okay, let's look at the black ones. I can actually see what the hell I'm looking at. <coughs> it's this one. Yeah, it's this one. I don't think I would do black inside. But we could do that railing there. Kind of like the glass. It has a more modern look. Modern feel to it. Not entirely sure though. Yeah, I don't know. We'll figure it out. <clears throat> I'm also not sure about this, like, this wall exactly. Maybe just regular wall would be better. But yeah, that's kind of the, the gist. I think this stuff, uh, probably want... I feel like wood accents for this place would be nice. I don't know if I actually like this bench here, to be honest. There was another one I liked better. Hmm. No, not black though. You wish those glass panels could be a little shorter? Uh, do you mean like for the, uh, for the staircase? Oh, I don't see it here. I don't see it here. The one that I liked, I mean, I like this one. But the one I was thinking of is not here. Uh, it's probably under surfaces. Lulu, you okay? You okay, baby? Okay. 
<coughs> Pardon me. Mm. No, it's under comfort. Whoa, that music just got hella loud in my ears. Sorry. <laughs> uh. Oh my god, I love these chairs! You know, I really wish that we could use these chairs for like, dining chairs and computer chairs. These are literally just meant to be like, in the living room. I'm like, when... Would you ever use this chair in the living room? I don't get it. <coughs> um. Um. Ottoman or whatever the heck you are. Okay, it's not that. Ah, yeah. Oh yeah, it's Dream Home Decorator. That makes sense. It's kind of like a... Like a vintage look. To it. But I like it. They used to have these chairs. They used to call them phone... Phone chairs. Because it used to have like a little ledge there for the telephone. And you could just sit there and talk. Uh, my grandmother had one. And we actually had it. Because we lived with her. Uh, like my dad, my brother, and I all lived with my grandma, and she had a lot of this an antique furniture. She had one of these, and it was called like telephone chair. It's all built in together. It was super cool. Yeah, I was thinking this this for the entryway is really nice. There we go. Just have some wooden wooden features and then some more plants. Obviously, we're gonna put down some rugs. Still not sure about paint color. I think I'm just gonna put white on the walls for now. White. Oh. Come on. No! <laughs> Sorry, my controller has a mind of its own sometimes. Kai? Is that in there? Did you get. Yeah. Is it everywhere? Almost. White in the bathroom. Oh, on the back of there. <clears throat> I'm gonna just put white everywhere right now. I just don't like looking at the drywall. It just takes away from the finished product. Love the old furniture knowledge. Aw. Yeah, I I had seen them before, but I didn't know what they were called. Well, when I was younger, obviously, I didn't know. My grandma told me, and I was like, oh, that's really cool. She kept that furniture since, like, the 60s. It had been reupholstered. Uh, my grandma and my aunts had reupholstered it several times since the 60s, and it was just like... Yeah, it's super neat. Um... <laughs> My aunt had another one that looked slightly different. I'm gonna just see if I can find it. Uh, phone chair. Antique. Yeah, so there's two. One was like a booth, kind of. Like the one here in the game. There wasn't any arms or anything on it. And then there's one that kind of looks like a chase lounge, like, with a little telephone thingy on it. Uh, and then this is basically the one my aunt had. So, here, let me see if I can uh, show this link here. I'm trying to find one that looks like my grandmother's as well. posting it in chat so you guys can click on that and you can see the link uh, see the picture <coughs> um, 
I don't know what year these were made, like those specific ones, but my aunt still has that one that's been reupholstered as well several times. Um, just seeing if I can find it. There's so many different ones. There's some really like super cute vintage looking ones. Uh, but basically, yeah. So the, my grandma had the one that looked like just a bench with no real backing or anything on it and just like the slightly taller uh, like here there was this part and then it was slightly raised for the telephone and then it was just like this and you'd put it in the hallway and then like the one that I, I posted in the chat as well with this actual like chair slash table connected together yeah they're super cool I always loved it as a kid. <laughs> we had those rotary phones, like, you know, the old ones where you'd have to stick your finger in and, like, you know, dial it one by one, go around in the circle. I loved that. I loved sitting in that chair and just using the phone. It was so much fun. <laughs> so, yeah, when I was a kid and growing up, I really enjoyed that. That was really, really s fun fun special times. Uh, my grandmother also had like a lot of um, she had like a very like old vintage writing desk like secretary's desk um, and she had a very old typewriter that went in it and it was just like my favorite thing to use. I always used it. So much fun. LAB, hello, good morning. How are you doing, hun? How are you doing? It's good to see you. We are just building my townhouses at the moment. <coughs> now that I look at this gray floor, I'm not really sure if I like it. I'm not really sure if I like it. I feel like with the gray floor, like, if we're just gonna do, like, monochromatic, everything should be kind of, like, black and white. Like, this should be black. I feel like these should also be black. If we're going with the gray and white theme. Like, we should do this. Do you think we should do gray and white in this house? And then we can do another one with, like, warm wood colors. I mean, this door is kind of already there. You're good just trying to wake up your son? Getting ready for school? <laughs> uh, my dad used to have to throw water on me sometimes because I hated waking up for school. It's like, why? <laughs> I don't want to go to school today. <laughs> yep. No, I think... I feel like... <clears throat> I like this floor. But I feel like I want this place to be warm. Woodsy colors. There's a lot of wood, but that's okay. Oh. Uh, we're doing brown with white in it. So that's this one. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, okay. Brown's on top. That one. I'm so indecisive, but I also have two other buildings or two other suites that I have to do, so they're not all going to be the same. They're not all going to be the same. I feel like we need to change the floor color. <laughs> Good luck, yeah. <laughs> Good luck, Ellie. Yes. You might need it with trying to wake up your son. 
<laughs> oh. These doors are not really like. This is about the only color I actually like. Hmm. Okay, so if we're having wood, we definitely need warmer floors. Um. Ah, uh, no, that's way too busy. Too red. Oh no, we're already using that one. Nope. <laughs> There's one that has a lot of different colors. That's none of these ones, apparently. Oh. Is this it? Ah, uh, but then the wood just blends right in. <clears throat> I hate that color. Oh, this gray floor is actually nicer. Oh, I kind of like this one better. It's like warm in a different way. Hmm. What do you guys think? Basketball floor? This flooring. Hmm. I don't know if gray is the floor color we need in this place, but I like this wood. I'm gonna put this down in this house so I can remember. <clears throat> what color of floor should we be putting in here? If we're gonna be using white. No. Should we do dark brown floor? It just seems like so much brown. Well, I'm gonna put carpets down. But still. White? What if we did a white floor with like moodier walls? Would that be a thing? <coughs> Uh, multi-peach, sorry about that. Hold on, let me... I don't know why that did that. Why did it time you out? Very strange. So sorry about that, I'm not sure why you got timed out. Um, one second here. Hold on. Let me do some fixing. My timed out bot timed you out. Oh! It's because your account is under 30 days old. That's why. So you can feel free to PM me. Uh, if you're not a bot, feel free to PM me and then let me just go fix this right now. Mute. Or whisper me. Uh, timed out bot. Let me fix this real quick. Sorry, you guys. Could work cookies? Like the white floor with like moody walls, maybe? What if we do like a darker color on the walls? <clears throat> hmm. Here, let's see. Oh god, I don't know how to change it. Hmm. 
Oh shoot. Okay, I don't know how to change that bot right now. My friend helped me with that. I'm so sorry. Uh, so, multi peach, I'm so sorry about that. Feel free to whisper me though. Um, yeah, I, I need to fix that actually. Should only be on like seven days. Okay, so white floors, moody walls. Um, I'm not sure if we want wallpaper yet. That basically looks like gray. Don't want super dark. Ooh, but we could do an accent wall. Like, that's pretty fun color, not gonna lie. But, <laughs> in the winter, <laughs> yeah, it would be super dark. It would be super dark. Oh, we could put a... Oh, I kind of like that. Hmm. Yeah, I could do a feature wall. Because if this is the wall with the TV, we probably want it lighter. So, yeah, multi-peach. I'm so sorry. Here, I, I get your whisper. Let me just check that real quick. I'm not quite sure how to fix this. This silly bot. Um, I'm gonna message my friend. He's actually still awake because he's in a different time zone. I'm gonna ask him how to do it real quick. How do I change the time for... Timed out bot. Oops. Oh yeah, he just checked his WhatsApp for uh, just a couple minutes ago, so... <clears throat> oh god! Eee. Sorry. <laughs> Dropped my controller. Multi-peach, hi there. It's okay, thanks for trying. Oh, Thank you so much for understanding. I'm gonna see if he can help me right now, since he is awake right now. How to fix it. I thought I put it on seven days, not thirty. Um <clears throat> help <laughs> Um Yeah. He should be getting back to me in just a couple minutes. <laughs> Thank you for understanding. Thank you for your patience, you guys. So sorry about that. So like, feature wall basically, or I don't know if it's called a feature wall or not, but basically one wall that's like kind of colored and then the rest are like neutral colors. <clears throat> oh, do we have, we have light colors in this, right? Ugh, that's too light. It's too light! I like these pastels, but uh... It's just so white. It's so light. Yeah, I think dark is the way to go. Or vibrant. Not this blue. But you know what I mean. <clears throat> huh. Could also put really colorful rugs on the floor. We're gonna change it up in the kitchen and dining room as well, so... It's gonna be different over there than it is from the living room. Hmm. Uh, oh, also I should explain the reason why um, I have the timed out bot set is just because of all the hate raids and stuff that have been going on. Um, Generally, the hate raid bots are usually made within basically a week, and so I set it. I originally set it for 30 days, 
And then I was like, no, that seems like overkill because somebody could easily have their account for like just a couple of weeks and be new to Twitch. Um, and then I set it to seven days, but it didn't stick apparently. So, oh yeah, he read my message, so he's gonna respond soon, I'm sure. Let's just do this for now. It seems super dark for some walls though. Nice pop of color though. But yeah, that's why I had that set originally, so... Yeah, I hope you guys understand that. <laughs> Definitely nothing personal, just to be extra safe, especially because usually when I stream I'm the only person that's actually awake. So I don't have any mods usually. <clears throat> Let's take a look at the carpets. Uh, or the rugs, I'm sorry. What is this? Paint splatter? Okay, no. No? I do like these. Oh, I love how symmetrical they are. <laughs> oh, I love rugs that are symmetrical. I just, uh, symmetrical stuff makes me happy. Not gonna lie. See, here I'm talking about putting color on the floor, and then what do I gravitate to? Black and white. Of course. <laughs> um... <sighs> yeah. Uh, again. <laughs> oh god, help me. <laughs> you guys, I can't stay away from the black and white. Oh my god. Mm, this is actually not a bad carpet. I guess we could shrink it down. Put it like an entryway carpet. Yeah, too big. Hmm. I don't know. Nope, we should do color. Oh, these are funky. <gasps> I've always wanted to use this carpet somewhere. Oh my god, that's huge. But... It matches the wall. If it goes under the stairs, it's gonna look a little weird. Eh, why can't it just be slightly bigger? Not like, jai freaking enormous. Okay, there goes my analog stick drifting off to wherever. Hmm. I've seen people layer carpets, and I'm like, that looks so good! But when I do it, I'm like, that looks stupid. <laughs> Why did I do that? <coughs> hmm. Ah, yes, I like these carpets as well. But again... They're small. Okay, I don't know. What color carpets should we be putting down here? Um. Also, we're gonna do runner, I think. Hmm. Ugh, my default carpet. I love this carpet so much. Tiny Living Pack is probably one of my absolute favorite packs. <laughs> Sorry, um... Just responding to my friend. Oops. Okay, he's checking. <coughs> Pardon me. <coughs> Just dying over here. Blue. Um, so yes, my friend is looking into it for me. 
Oh my god, it's the same color that's on the wall! That's not good. Okay. Well, I mean... What color? I feel like the floor is wrong. Sorry, try layering carpets you think are meh. I find a lot of the time they distract from each other. Yeah, that's actually a good idea. Like this gross puddle shaped one. <laughs> like, why is this a thing? Who wants to put carpets like that in their house? Not me. That like legit drives my OCD crazy. It's like, what the fuck? Like, you're not straight. <laughs> I don't like it. And you're not round either. Oh yeah, I like these carpets. Oh yeah. Hmm, we just need more rugs. That's the be all and end all of this. We need more rugs. I almost said, come on Twitch, get your shit together. I mean, yeah, Twitch, get your shit together. But also, Sims, get your shit together. God, I'm so boring. Just like, yeah, this is a great carpet, guys. <laughs> it's, it's fucking neutral. Um. Hmm. Oh yeah, I forgot about these ones. These are cute. Not really the vibe I'm going for though. This is kind of boho and like I'm going for modern, kind of like chic. Which is really hard to do with their lack of carpet choices, gotta say. I have seen people like use this carpet. Uh, there's another one I've seen people use. It's not this one, it's the base game one. That's just like solid color. Do you know what I'm put? This one! I've literally seen people like layer these rugs, which looks really cool. I like that. But I mean like not this color or anything, but I like layering them, like how they do that. It looks really neat. I don't really want round carpets in here though. <laughs> <clears throat> Ouch. Oh, he said he'll let me know once uh, the people respond to him about the timed out bot. <sighs> now it's just a waiting game. <sighs> oh, I'm so indecisive. Why am I so indecisive? This is my worst trait. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, I think... <clears throat> I mean... I do like the dark on the wall though. But I think the floor color needs to change. I like the white, but it's not really... It's not for this house, I don't think. Okay, so I'm gonna go through each and every one of these. Hmm, it's kind of lighter, but also super rustic looking. It's not very clean looking. I don't like that. Oh my god, purple. Oh my god. <laughs> Could you imagine? Honey, I'm home. Oh! <laughs> Blinded by the color of the freaking wood. Ah, the tatami floors. Yeah. Not for this house. Um, is it this one? This also looks super rustic. At least it's a different color of wood. Not sure it exactly matches the vibe I'm going for though. This wood looks like it would give you splinters if you walked on it barefoot. Ah, it's this one. 
Oh, uh, it's this one! Yeah, it's this one. It's this one. This is my- this is one of my favorite floors. One of my favorite. Hold on. Let's see what it looks like the long ways. I feel like it'll be better long. These are short boards though, so I could be wrong. <coughs> Pardon me. Um, we're gonna do tile in the bathroom, so that's fine. Okay, so the wood color is very similar. So what if we... Okay, if we do lighter colored walls, we could do this brown and still pull it off. Because it's not the exact same color as those things. Okay, let's change the wall color. I usually... <clears throat> I should just stick with what I normally do, which is decorate the entire house first and then figure out wall colors because honestly I'm like the most indecisive person ever. Because you can always change colors of furniture later if you don't like it, so I'm just going to do that. <clears throat> okay. We're just going to leave it white. Let's get some stuff. Okay, we're going to do computer desk. Now what kind of desk should we put here? Um, this is the same color of the floor though. Oh, that's too yellow. Ew. I don't like that color. Ah, yes. Dark. Dark rich. See, why can't they have this? These in, like, all these colors of brown. Like, this is the closest, I guess. But I don't think this one has this dark brown. It has black, though. Yeah, I don't really like that. Hmm. Such a waste of wall space. I think this computer disk is too tall for this area. Like, I want... <clears throat> Sorry. One thing is to be... <laughs> like, that's why I'm not sure if I like the, uh, the stairs or if I want the wall there. I might make it a wall again. Because the desk I was thinking to use was this one. And that's too tall, I think. With the glass there. Hmm. What do you like? What do you guys think? Too tall? I think we need something short here. Hmm. Maybe a different color of that desk. ever used this desk. Uh, it's it's kind of cute, but... No. That one's kind of nice. It's very simple. Simple is what I want. That's ugly. No thank you. I mean, it's not suited for like an entryway. When I say something's ugly, it doesn't mean I'd actually think it's ugly, it's just it doesn't suit this build. You know, I could also just buy a really tiny, <laughs> really tiny desk and put it there. Hmm. One of my favorite desks is this tiny living one, though. Not gonna lie. 
But again, it's not the vibe. I, I think this one... Or this one. You know what? Maybe I should make the furniture white. That's, I usually end up doing that. That's my usual. <laughs> <coughs> and then I ch change the color of the walls and all the furniture is basically white. This doesn't have a white... Oh god, I don't know. You would buy? You would buy? Okay, well. What color did I have here? Wasn't it pink? Yeah. Hmm, this brown now doesn't really match. Oh, I don't like that bookshelf right now. I was liking it, now I'm not really liking it. Could also just put a simple bookshelf on the wall. Freeze up floor space. Well, it's kind of maybe a better idea. Oh, this bookshelf. I love this bookshelf. Oh, I wish we could lift this bookshelf up, though. Do you know what I mean? Like, I wish we could raise it a little bit. Oh, I do love this bookshelf, though. They have all the same colors as this desk, which is kind of nice. <clears throat> hmm. Okay, let's see. I need to go get some more water. Okay, I know it's a lot of brown. Bear with me here. Is that right? Uh, the computer. Ugh, this is gonna be in the way, isn't it? I don't like that. I think I might make this a wall. <coughs> it was a wall. Mm-hmm. Let's see. could just put a giant painting here. Also could put like a stained glass window. I like the little um, <clears throat> stained glass windows we have here. This one in particular. Um, excuse me? Oh my god, hold on. I'm like, um, what's going on here? <clears throat> Cute. Oh, I think I would need like two of these or something. If we were gonna do that. It's too small, but I like it. I like stained glass. Well, okay, so stained glass is not a good idea, but there's lots of paintings in the gallery. <clears throat> so, stairs or wall? Stairs or wall? That is the question. Or just a small desk. Because we don't need a ginormous desk. Let's see what it looks like with a small desk. Um, I know this is a teen writing desk, but let's just take a look. <clears throat> um, don't we have another small desk? Like other than this one? Thought we had another small one. 
Or am I mistaken? I think I'm mistaken, actually. I really like this. This is neat. I mean, I guess I could use that. Doesn't even look like it's there. I'm not really sure, guys. This stumps me all the time. I think I need a break for a sec, so I have to go get some water anyways. So when I come back, y'all can tell me if it's stairs with the railing or stairs with the wall. Which do you think? And yes, I'm gonna go get some water, use the washroom, and feed the kitty and I'll be back in about five minutes.
Hello, well, thank you guys for waiting. Bev! Shall catch you later, lovely. Good luck with the furnishings. Much love. Thank you so much for hanging out tonight. Or, I guess, this morning. It's been a lot of fun having you here. Have a good day. Um. I still am curious about the stairs. If you did a platform at the corner, could you get rid of the glass panels at the top of the stairs? What do you mean a platform? You mean this? I'm confused. Hmm. Oh. Maybe I'm trying to be too fancy over here. Hmm. Well, let's take a look at the computer desks again. Come on, analog stick, work with me. Hmm. Could just do a plain desk, honestly. Uh, that's a little too black. Um. Okay, they don't really have the colors I like. Well, the kid's desk could be fine. I'm feeling like this isn't a big deal. Like if it is slightly over the glass railing there, not really a big deal. There also should be enough room between this and the chair that will go here. We shouldn't need to move the desk out any further. Um, oh, interesting. I never saw the colors to these chairs before. Hmm. Usually I honestly just stick with black and I just do this chair. <sighs> yeah, the chair's not gonna get in the way. Okay. Computer. Ugh, I love buying this computer for them. Um... that there. Okay, kind of like a home office. I know it's like directly in front of the door, but I mean, people might see that and be like, oh my god, I could steal that. You know, in real life, but you know, you know, in the game it's a little different. Does this just look really dumb here? Maybe we should put couches over there or something. Hmm, <laughs> right in front of the window. Yeah, no thanks. <coughs> I feel like it's a good area for this because there's not a lot of space here. I mean, I could angle it. I could also put the bookshelf elsewhere. Put a plant behind that, maybe? Should I angle it? Does that look dumb? Let me put a plant back there. And let's see. You like it, cookies? Okay, well, let me put a plant back there. And like, let's see what it looks like. This is tall. 
This is kind of tall, yeah. Could do several plants and kind of stack them behind. different tile like in the bathroom <clears throat> okay so I do want to put plants here so it's either uh, like that like on an angle or on either side of it <clears throat> so there would be a plant on either side I think this one's clipping through the wall no, it's not actually. Now it is. Okay. I don't know what plants I'd put, but just for the sake of this, I'd put two. One on either side. Because we like the greenery. I like greenery. We are going to be putting plants and stuff on the wall as well. Uh, also, that mirror. I forgot about the mirror. So, let's do that. Um, <clears throat> did you guys like the corner? Or... The, uh... I guess I could put it in the closet as well. <laughs> hmm. I honestly thought about doing this entire wall mirrors. Because it's such a small space, mirrors give the illusion of making it look bigger. <clears throat> um, can't move this mirror up though, which is annoying. Oh my god, that's still painted that color. That's hilarious. Mm -hmm. Okay, so straight on like that. Or did you like it better turned in the corner? The plant there, like in the corner. I would still put a plant of some sort here. Probably not this one though, it's too big. Or p put a plant on the desk, that's probably what I do. Like both? Yeah, me too. That's why I'm having such a dilemma. <laughs> Well, I can always change it later. Guess let's just leave it like this for now then. Oops. Yeah, let's just leave it like that for now. Um Actually, maybe I'll put this I'll leave that there and I'll put a painting here. Uh do we like this mirror here? Yes. <clears throat> Free placement. Yes? Okay. Uh, so that aligns with the bench. Let's do it just a little bit over. There. Yeah. Looks good. 
<clears throat> okay. So we are going to put a painting here. I'm not sure what painting yet. Let's take a look at the gallery. Actually, before we do that, let's save it. Because we have not saved in like a bajillion years. <laughs> oh boy. Wouldn't that suck? I, it's not like I've done a ton of progress or anything, but... <clears throat> Come on. I just don't like losing progress. <clears throat> okay, gallery. <sighs> I don't know why it does that to me. <coughs> Pardon me. No, it's under my library. Um, yeah, okay, so we have... Cute kitty art. Let that shit go. <laughs> uh... I mean, I like those paintings. Um, sunflowers. Country hills. Well, what kind of painting would we put there? I guess that is the question. Uh, kitchen art? No. I love the kitchen art though, we will be using those. Um, hmm. These are all the beachy ones. Okay, so they're all from here up. Colorful edition. <coughs> Could also use like three of these square paintings and make them smaller. I kind of want something like kind of like. I don't know. Pretty yet abstract. What's this? Oh, these are all the night nice sky ones. I love those. Yeah, those are nice. Not the vibe I'm going for right now. I like those a lot too. Hmm. Oops. Is this the green ones? Yeah. Don't. Okay, so the kitties! They're so cute! Just go with this this uh shit, where am I gonna put this? Uh let's put you right here. Oh, actually I can put this on the back. Yeah, over here. Eee! If my controller will work with me. 
<clears throat> right there. <clears throat> Let that shit go. Now we're just gonna make you smaller. Or should we put something colorful here? Yeah. Analog drift. It's a thing. I feel like that's something you'd probably put in your bedroom or your office. leave it up here because I'm gonna want to use that but I am gonna get rid of this whole this whole thing cookies are gonna leave now okay sounds good hun thank you so much for being here tonight today tonight <laughs> um I hope you have a good night and we'll see you soon take care hun bye Okay, I'm gonna do a colorful painting there. Actually, let's just take a look at what the gallery has. <clears throat> Whoops. Love your streams. Aww. I love your streams too. It's been a while since I've been in yours. I'm so sorry about that. Soon. But I'm so glad you were able to come and hang out for a bit. But, yes, I'll, I'll see you soon, hun. Have a good night. Take care. Sleep well. Oh, yeah, we do have quite a few more paintings in here now. Oh, by the way, not sure if um, Multi Peach is still here. But. I'm going to fix my thingamabobber right now. Gonna fix it. Man, I am thirsty. Um, yeah, so give me just one second, you guys. I'm just gonna fix my <coughs> timed out bot thing. They got back to me. My friend got back to me. So I'm going to fix it right now. Just mute that. Uh, okay, so how many hours are in one week? So 24 times 7. 168, okay. Let me just see if this works. Sorry, y'all. Yeah, okay, there we go. Okay, perfect. So I changed it. It worked. Thank... Thankfully. Okay. <coughs> there we go.
think that's it. I think that's all I need to do. Ouch. guys. Okay, so I just fixed the Okay. Yeah, I just fixed the timed out bot. Okay, there we go. Yeah, it looks like you j uh, you did it. Just got here. Yes, perfect. Hello. Hey, hey. Okay, cool. So that's good. Maybe 30 days was overkill. <laughs> um, yeah, so that's good though. Got it fixed. Thank you for helping me with that. I appreciate it. Um, yeah. So now, we're just looking for some paintings. Ooh. Ooh, maybe one of these. <gasps> Look how pretty these are! Yeah, this is like the abstract I was talking about. That's really cool. I mean, I really like this, I'm not gonna lie. Hmm. Lurk! Alright, thanks bro, I appreciate the lurk. <clears throat> okay. Well. <laughs> Picture of a plant. Oops. Okay, well that's fine. Um, I'm just gonna take a look here at the other ones, cause I kinda want a long picture or... Let's see. Oh, I love this. I love that big picture. Okay, um... Hmm. Okay, so yeah, I guess if we do that, we could also do this. Hold on, let me. This kind of feels a little more personal. I could put a couple of these here, perhaps. Art in a box. I like this. <clears throat> Come on. Well, we don't really want it all the way to the floor, so okay, let's just move this one down a bit. God dang analog stick. Stop doing that. Stop it. <coughs> okay. I mean, that's really cute. I like it. Has the green in it. just a little bit. Um, okay, so now that we got that, let's do the little carpet here in front of the door. I usually like to use uh, this, uh, where is it, this one? Yeah, usually I like to use this one. However, we could use a bigger carpet. <clears throat> or just change this one up. Uh, let's see. Oops. Not that. 
I mean, I like that. <sighs> okay, another carpet. <clears throat> Come on. Rugs. There we go. This is what called us a stone circle. That's really weird. Doesn't even look like a stone. Does that look like a stone to you? Doesn't look like a stone to me. Does not look like a stone to me. Then again, what do I know? Uh, okay, so let's do a slightly larger carpet here. Um, hmm. Kind of like. Oh, these are small too. But you could also make them bigger. Okay, I don't want that color. I mean, it is cute though. Oh, it's blue. I didn't even notice, actually. I thought that was black. Oh. Interesting. But I still think we need something. No. Excuse me. Grab the thing. Actually, you know what? Could probably. Hmm. I think that's a little. Yeah, that's a little too big now. <clears throat> okay, let's choose a different group. My controller is going nuts with the analog drift. Also, I'm actually starting to get tired finally. So I'm not sure how much more of this. Oh, sorry. Not sure how much more of this I'll stream. But for now. We're gonna continue until I can't take it anymore. What if we got rid of this small one in front of the door and use this instead? Really like this carpet. It's just too dang big though. It's like the perfect size carpet if I just put it here. Hmm. Actually, I don't know if I like that color, but... Like, something like this is really... Actually, I really like this black. Uh, what if we... Made the chair white, maybe? <coughs> Blue? Mm, computer... I actually like this black carpet here. I feel like we need a bigger carpet here, but I'm not sure yet. Um, umbrella. Um, no. Fuck's sakes. Fucking hate typing on this stupid thing. Okay, bushki. Alright. Where should we put this? Right here, maybe?
You know what? We could just do tile on the entrance way instead of a carpet. Let's do... What if we just did the same black tile <clears throat> that's outside? Bring it on to the inside. Oh wait, it's not tile. Uh, masonry. Yes, this one. Hold on. So what if we just did that? Hmm. <laughs> Lulu, you little cutie. <coughs> Cause now there's some kind of separation. Maybe there's too much black here, I don't know. Now we could put a carpet down in this little area. I'm gonna change the color of this. I'm gonna make it that color. Um, okay, now let's put a little carpet down there actually. I think that would look good. Now if we just do like a solid color solid color go up there we go what's i don't even know what color this is oh that doesn't look very good oh this is like when you stand on in a in a cafe or something um well i guess you know what, we could also just do the same rug. Just do the same rug. I don't know, I was gonna put flowers here. Or flowers, sorry, plants here. Um. Hmm. Maybe we need a different carpet. Hold on. <clears throat> One that's slightly longer, so that it goes all the way to the edge of the black, maybe. Weird, I never looked at that carpet. What's this one? What is this? Oh, it's flowers. Hmm, no thank you. Ah. What if we just made this smaller? That weird. It's like the same carpet but smaller. Square as well. Fuck off. Oh my god. Hmm. Yeah, it feels too, uh, too much the same. I mean, this green one is cute. Where is it? That one's cute. It's a little. I mean, I like that one actually. <coughs> um, I don't know if I like it more than this one. Ah, decisions, decisions. Decisions, decisions. Does that go under the door at all? No. Okay, that's good. You know what, maybe I'll just put the plants outside on either side of the door. <clears throat> just have our umbrellas here. It's not gonna interfere with that, hopefully. What if I did this carpet here instead? No. I almost... Like, I like this carpet here, but I'm not sure... 
Now that I put the black on the floor there, I'm not sure if I like it better. Maybe I should do a different color on the floor here. Oh my god, decisions, you guys. Um... Actually, let's look at masonry again. Actually, this would look good outside. It's kind of the same color as the stairs. But nah, it's okay. I don't know. The black. What about... Does that look weird inside? I feel like if I had a bigger entranceway, <clears throat> like I've used that in entranceways before, and it looked fine. Yeah, that looks like way too much outside. Yeah. Actual tile or that black one that I just had there. Oh, actually these ones are okay. Uh, um, yeah. Let's uh, see. Now if we put a darker colored carpet. Oops, didn't mean to get rid of that. Something darker here. Or something colorful. Something darker and colorful, it would look good. Not that though. But something like that. Just go through these. These actually look better when they're bigger. Oh. This is not bad because it kind of ties the color of the plants in. <coughs> and also then it's not super black in here. And we still don't know what color we're gonna do the walls, but that's okay. I feel like that looks pretty decent, actually. And this can be black again. Um. That could even be like that. That actually looks good. It fits perfectly in that tile, somehow, and it's like a combination of all the colors that are here, <coughs> which is super nice. Sorry. Um, <clears throat> I got a notification on my phone and it was like, 
I was confused by it. <clears throat> you know, it is almost too similar. I do like it though. I really do like this green, actually. <laughs> what if we just did the same carpet? Just one small, one big. <laughs> um, no. Okay, we're set green. There we go. We're just gonna leave it like that. I like it because it ties in the plants. Okay, so I've hardly <laughs> done anything here. Let's do the bathroom. I already know the tile we're gonna use in the bathroom. It's always the same tile in every bathroom. Well, not every bathroom. It's basically the same tile we just used. Or, it's one of these two. I like... Hmm, not that one. I like these ones. Okay, yeah, we'll use that. It's nice and clean. Still don't know what color the walls are gonna be. Bathrooms are usually like, I do blue of some sort. But for right now, this is just gonna be half bath. I like the slate toilets. I just like the way they look. They would be a bitch to clean though, I would think. Also, I like using these for like main bathrooms because they're so colorful and I mean, your sims like to talk to them which is kind of annoying. But this one is really creepy. Like this to me is like a a toilet you put in here on Halloween. <laughs> um, what's this? Oh, that's a talking one as well. Uh, oh yeah, they're both talking ones. Interesting. Okay, never mind. We're just gonna do slate and the sink. Whenever it wants to work, there we go. Uh, where's the slate sink? <clears throat> there it is. Uh, oh yeah, that's right. This one doesn't really have a just a pure white version. <coughs> okay. That's fine. Okay. Okay. Bathroom. Simple. Need the toilet paper roll. Uh, toilet paper. Got a mirror. Toilet paper. They really need to add some more like variations of this toilet paper. Go in there. Hmm. Well, I guess I could just put it across. Oh, it's a little far. But also, the Sims are kind of dumb and like to get stuck on it, so I don't know. Is that really. Yeah. Is that really close to the floor, I say? It's like right against the floor. Uh. Yeah, that's a better height. Okay, so <clears throat> I hate small bathrooms because can't see anything. So I'm gonna just put that there and remove these two walls for a sec because I can't see shit. Mm -hmm. 
It's like, why is that going up so high? <laughs> and, uh... sink actually now I'm seeing it here. Eh, whatever. It's a fan. Okay, so mirrors. Mirror, mirror on the wall. I usually just use fuck off controller. Oh my god, stop being a dumb bitch. This one. <laughs> Usually I just use this, because I like the way that it looks. I just do that. Um, but I don't know if I'm feeling that right now. Something square. Hmm. We lack some decent square mirrors in this game. Cause they're so weird. Like, some of them are super low to the counter and some of them are, <clears throat> sorry, super tall. And I just don't understand. Like, that's usually why I use the long mirror because it goes floor to ceiling, you know? This one is backlit, which I, I think is really cool. Hmm. Yeah, you know what? It's oh my god, I don't know. Round this one. Now I'm just gonna use the full length mirror like I usually do. I wasn't going to, but I figure like why not? Uh towel <coughs> Come on. I just have to click the damn thing. Oh my god, my controller is being stupid right now. <sighs> there we go. Okay. Okay, so. Well, I'm probably gonna do the walls in here blue, so maybe we should just stick with. prevent them from using it? I hope not. It's kinda too far up in the air, I think. Yeah, it looks... looks strange. kind of like in the sink. Kind of looks like it's built in, completely honest. <laughs> it's kind of interesting. Okay, let's just do, while I have the walls off, paint the color that we want in here. I'm thinking like a not teal, but like a light blue. Not that. That. Uh. Hold on. This. Love. So 
So I love this, um, like the ombre. Really like that. This is super bright. I think that's too bright. Uh, dare I say too bright? <clears throat> it's kind of like I want to do like a dark blue in here. Uh, excuse me, that's green. I said blue. That's too bright. These are supposed to be darks. That's too dark. Well, we could just do the wall behind the toilet and then leave the other walls a different color. Maybe I'll do the floors darker as well. And then... Not that... Um, I don't have a grey... Yeah, ugh. That looks like garbage! No, not green. Okay, it's like a slightly darker white. <coughs> It's like slightly grayish. I think I'll do the opposite wall dark blue as well. Uh, okay, now let's just change the color of the tile. I wish you could just uh, change the tile that's already on the floor without having to go back to it. Kind of like you can do with the furniture. That'd be really nice. Okay, so that's the one that I have on the floor. Oops. Is that, is that too weird of a blue? <clears throat> yeah, it's kind of more teal. Ooh, we could use the slate floor instead. Oh, the slate blue. That actually goes with that bathroom. Because you got a mixture of the gray and the blue in there. Yeah, I like that. Okay. <coughs> Sorry. Okay, so yeah, so let's just do this then. And we're gonna take, oh my god, come on, this blue. There we go. We're also gonna do it on this, this side of the wall. So two walls are gonna be white, two walls are gonna be blue. I need some better lighting. Um. What the fuck? No. Uh. No. We need it to turn around. There we go. Okay. like that. I feel like we need a different light in here. <coughs> but for now, this bathroom is fine. Oh, I didn't realize uh, the design was on the other side of the door as well. Duh. That totally makes sense. I don't know why. I don't know why I didn't think about that. But that's okay. Okay, I'm just gonna leave this bathroom for now. I want to add some shelving or something behind the toilet, but I'll do that later. Okay, so the entranceway is pretty much done, like on the inside. Now this is gonna be the living room, so we're gonna search TV. 
Or actually, we're just gonna go to electronics. That's what we're gonna do. Living room. Doesn't have to be a massive TV. Yeah, that's, that's decently sized. Let's see. I mean, I love this TV, but <laughs> but this living room is so small <laughs> that um, <laughs> you're going to need to sit a lot further away. Hmm. I don't know why this one's like 3500. It looks weird. Like that's, yeah. Well, I guess it depends where we put the couch and stuff too. See, I wanted to put windows on this wall and I didn't. Maybe I should remove these pictures and put a window there. It's the outside of the house. I wanted to utilize this wall. But yeah, maybe I'll move some stuff around. <clears throat> Okay, we're gonna put the TV... There for now. <coughs> <coughs> I think we'll put the bookshelf in the living room. Sectional or little couch? Oh, let's see. Hmm. I really do love this couch. This is such a cozy looking couch and I absolutely love this couch. The only thing is when you walk in, it's basically gonna be there. So I'm wondering if I should put a couch here and then put like a couple chairs here or something. Or if I should have put the TV on that side and put this like here. And put the desk over here. Oh my god, I don't know. Such a small area to work with. I could have made this the living room. And the rest. Dining. And kitchen. It makes more sense though because we're gonna have a grill back here. Makes sense for the living room to be up here. I feel like like I really love these couches but if we make our own sectional we can have like the sectional Why is it clipping through the wall? What the frick? That's weird. If you put it against the wall, it clips through the wall. Don't know why. Super weird. But they also have rounded seats. Um. Wedges. So it's like you could do like combine them and make kind of like a round seating area. Uh, I just wanted to see what that would look like. <coughs> <coughs> walk around it like like you can walk here 
walk here and between the couch or you just put the couch together and then you have the couch you know the living room kind of just like that <coughs> I think three people or only two people can sit here I feel like if we do a straight couch, like a curved one, like a sectional instead of this rounded one, we could probably get more people in the living room. This round one seems to take up quite a bit of space. Yeah, so let's do... Let's do it slightly differently. And then I'm probably gonna save it. You go to bed. Cause I am getting super tired now for some reason. Eh, not quite yet actually. But yeah, probably pretty soon. Within like half an hour to an hour. Guess it's not super soon, I guess. <clears throat> like what I mean there's this oh actually Lotus loads hello how are you it has been a little while how are you doing You're doing great. Good. I'm glad to hear that actually. It's been such a long time. Um, I'm doing well as well. Um, I'm just very tired, if I'm completely honest. <laughs> but that's normal because I haven't slept in three days. <laughs> so that's why. But I'm doing really good. Despite not sleeping. I'm doing really good. What have you been up to lately? <clears throat> I feel like four people could sit here. Definitely need to back it up though. Mm. Uh, I kind of almost like that better. So weird if I back it all the way up this way. Just make one giant, like this entire area, couch area. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, I have a really annoying cough right now. Mm. Uh, I'm just trying to figure this out. Come on, sometime today. There we go. Okay, let's see. Let's just do blue, for example. Just wanna see. I feel like it's too much couch for this tiny little space. Too much a couch. Too much couch for this tiny little space. Uh, um, I don't know if I even like this couch here. I kind of liked the round ones better. Hmm. Hmm. good minus the sleep yeah I haven't really slept in three days so I'm quite tired now but I tried sleeping really early today at like seven <sighs> I couldn't sleep so I was up for a few hours and then I had dinner at like 1 30 or 2 a.m. so 
Needed time to digest my food after that. Uh, you've been homeschooling the kids and getting settled in your temporary home, saving and searching for a for home. Oh my gosh, that's so much work. But that's so exciting. I mean, I think homeschooling the kids is like, I think that's really cool. But a lot of work. <laughs> it's definitely a lot of work. Um, but yeah, kudos to you. That's that's a hard job. A hard job. I don't like the blue, but I mean, I don't really like how square this is. Chelsea, good morning. How are you doing, Chelsea? How was your sleep? You would take one piece off from the walkway and leave the rest. Oh, <laughs> I just demolished it all. I'm like, beh, you can go. Also, I'm not sure if I like like this couch more because there's like wood on the back of it. Hmm. I don't know. Whoops. No. No. See, I kind of like the round ones. I'm not gonna lie. But I think only two sims can sit here then. I don't think two can sit on this couch. If I put two pieces on the round couch, I think only two sims can sit here. I fell asleep at like 9.30? Oh my god, that's where you were. <laughs> I was in shoddy stream for a long time and I was like, where's Chelsea? Makes sense now. You were sleeping. Glad that you had a good sleep, though. So, uh... Lotus, how is the search going for your forever home? Hmm. <laughs> you did. Good. I'm glad to hear it. Is it funny though the couches like apart from each other? See, I still feel like this couch is too small. Oh, it fits here perfectly. Could put plants in the corner behind it and then continue this to be straight. Can also move the TV. So I wanted to put. <clears throat> I like these here, but I wanted to put a window here. So I'm wondering. I should move these. Somewhere you can see them. Like here. TV like there. I want this bookshelf here, but I also am gonna move it because <clears throat> I want to put a window on that wall. Cause I can't put windows on this wall. So chills, and since everyone like that's just come in doesn't know what we're actually building right now. We're making townhomes for the Build Newcrest Challenge. So this is what we're doing. I took a inspiration from Brown House Townhome in my local city that's currently being developed right now. There's a lot of these types of like little townhomes though here. But uh, yeah, so this is basically what we're doing. It's just one lot, obviously, but... Uh, don't mind the double door. These will actually, I'll be deleting these and putting windows here instead. But for now, it's just to light, like, let light in, you know? But yeah, so basically, the back deck, it's, uh, everyone has their own deck. It's gonna be great. And yeah, so this is the front. <clears throat> I kind of messed it up a little bit. It's not quite the way I wanted it to be, to be perfectly honest. So I might build this again once this one is finished, just to see if I like it better or not. 
yeah, so that's what we're kind of doing today. We're just building this. Upstairs, I'll be... <clears throat> this is going to be one bedroom. This is going to be another, except I'm going to make a bigger bathroom here. Kind of like a Jack and Jill bathroom. Where there's going to be a door here and a door here. So both bedrooms will have access to the bathroom. Instead of putting a door in the hall. <coughs> um, and then, because we're already going to have two doors in this hall very tiny hallway so I really didn't want to put another one here so that's what we're gonna do there and that's basically what we're gonna do for all of them like I'm just gonna copy the exact same layout but uh, each townhouse so to speak is gonna be different colors and stuff like different like I have gray floor in this one I'm doing warmer colors in this one for right now so yeah, and thank you! Yeah, I'm super happy with how this is turning out so far. I also was thinking instead of using like... <clears throat> Come on, copy. Sometime today, there we go. Um, those faux balconies that are in the front here, with the these ones here, I was thinking about using these for the bedrooms up here instead of building a deck. And then just put plants and stuff on them. Also, thank you for the follow, Lotus. I appreciate it. I appreciate it a lot. Um, okay, let's see. Uh... <laughs> thank you, yeah. <laughs> um... Oh, sorry, I totally missed your comment. Uh, it's taken some time. Our loan is approved for rural areas only. And those go as soon as they hit the market. But I've got hope that our time will come. Yes! Your time will come. It will happen. It will happen. Just need to give it just a little bit of time. But I'm certain it'll happen. My friends are also... Like, they actually just found their forever home. <clears throat> Pardon me. Um, and it was like pretty amazing because they had been looking for quite a while. So yeah, it was like, I don't know, I feel like it was lucky that they were able to find it. Oh, sorry. Oh, that, that looks kind of cool actually, having like... Doesn't that look kind of cool? That was a total accident. Does look kind of cool. Maybe not so much from the outside, but maybe this one's slightly taller. It's kind of neat. I like it. <laughs> it looks really weird on the outside, <laughs> especially because everything's so boxy. <laughs> uh, you know, I think I might just use these windows uh, for the side of the house. I'm not sure, we'll see. Come on, there we go. Okay, this one actually might be a better fit. I only used these two small ones because of those balconies. Uh, like the balcony is very like thin. So the other windows were too wide. Could just do that. I can bring down some of the upstairs windows downstairs, which is kind of nice. Uh, although, not that low. How? Is that like. Okay. Sorry, I'm just trying to measure. Yeah, so that's basically where it'd be. Okay, I like that because then when you're sitting here working on the computer, just look outside. It doesn't look as nice, in my opinion, as the bookshelf. And the pictures did. 
but I really wanted a window because... Well, you know what? I guess I could remove this mirror. I could remove the mirrors and put a window here and put those back, actually. Mm. Let's just see what that looks like for a second here. I'm curious. Uh... Yeah, this might work. This might work. Also, you're gonna be sitting right in front of the window. <clears throat> I do kind of like the idea of centering the window, though. What? Let's just see here. I liked the clutter kind of like over here because it's like a little office area, you know? Homey. Like, I, I just like the way that this looks. It looks nice. I don't know if I even like the window on this wall. I want a window here. Guess I could get a small one and like run it across the top or something, but I want a big window. Although this window's kinda too big, I think. Mm. Also, it's gonna be the same on the other side. Also, I'm trying to utilize the windows on the outside of the like the property because the inside unit is not going to have any windows except either end. So we're going to have to utilize the mirrors in that one. <clears throat> I kind of feel like I liked the uh oops. I liked the mirrors better. Because you always want to look at yourself before you leave the house. Make sure there's nothing on you. Mm. There we go. Chelsea, how is Michael this morning? If you're still here. How's little Michael doing? I could also do like a small window here. What about one of those? What about just one of these windows? Could I do that? Do like the window here? It just looks super weird with the uh, the mirrors here, I think. So that's the height the window would need to be. Oops. Oh, that looks kind of nice too. So indecisive, you guys. <laughs> Fuck. Oh gosh. <coughs> Sorry. Mm, that could work. Oh, the plant is clipping through the wall. hard to see. Ah, eh, whatever. It's just clipping through the window a little bit. It's fine. Um, Alright, love. Kiddos are getting up. Happy streaming. Happy I caught you. It's gr and looking great, by the way. <laughs> Thank you so much, hon. Okay, bye and happy streaming. Thank you so much, Lotus. We'll see you soon, hon. Take care. Have a good day with the kiddos. Also, uh, is it Lintunin? Lintu? Lintunin? Lintunin? I'm sorry if I pronounced your name wrong. Thank you so much for the follow, I appreciate it. Also, Chelsea, how is uh, Michael doing today? How are you and Michael doing? Do we like the window there, you guys? 
<clears throat> I kinda like that now. I kinda like that with the pictures above, like in alignment there. <coughs> oh, I like it better when it's darker frame. There we go. Much better. Much better. But yes, thank you so much for the follow in twin, I appreciate it. Oh, and sorry, I moved this. Okay, so that's what I was testing. That's what I was testing. I totally lost track of what I was doing originally. But... Also, I'm not sure I want to use these chairs. I might want to use those ones, but for the sake, we'll use this one for now. <clears throat> or maybe... That's such a small living room. Definitely should not use that. Oops. Hmm. It's interesting. I feel like it should be square to like fill up the entire area. But at least this way we can put plants behind there. Hmm. I don't know, I don't work well with tiny spaces. And this is like, oh, you have to go through here. I feel like this comes out too much. We could put a chair there. They have their own chairs. Like that. That kind of enables for like more walking area as well. I don't know if that's exactly where I'd put the chair, but. Hmm. What if we just did. A little bit of a couch, and then like a couple chairs, like one there, one there. Only two parts of a couch here. Ow, my ankle. Uh, I don't know. Let's let's just test it out. Let's uh, just test it out. Kind of like this one better though. I don't know. It looks comfier to me. Okay, let's do that. This and the far that side and then the chairs. One, two. Okay, let's get rid of this and that. Okay, we'll test two things. There we go. Small furniture places. Oh my gosh. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, guys. <coughs> I mean, that's not as crowded. Easier to walk around. But I'm wondering if we should put the couch in this corner. And then just do like two chairs here instead. I don't know, I'm not good at this. The living room furniture in tiny houses, I am not good at. I am not good at. I mean, if we have two chairs here, it's gonna be easier for Sims to walk around. We all know they like to get stuck on things. Half tile, there we go. 
That looks really stupid, actually. You might as well just put three chairs in the living room at this point. <clears throat> Um... Yeah, let's put the couch back. It didn't look terrible there, it's just very close, that's all. That's fine though. It's not the end of the world. Good. Enough. Um. Oh, oh, frick. I was like, why is it so bright? It's because I turned it to daytime again. That's right. So, okay, so this is... very strange, doesn't it? I don't know anybody's living room that's set up like this. <coughs> um, it's this couch. It just throws off the whole vibe. Because the kitchen is going to start like right here. So we don't want... Maybe we just don't need anything except a couch. I don't know. Um, conflicted. Also, don't want the chair right against the window. Well, we could also d just do four chairs. I guess this isn't bad. The Sims can always just walk this way. <coughs> I wanted to put a table there, but I honestly... I do not think that there is enough room for that. See, what I should have done, which is what I was supposed to do, which I kind of messed up, was this door was supposed to go all the way to the edge. So we would have had this extra square of space had I actually put the door here. Uh. It's either I make this the dining room put the table right here and then chairs and this the kitchen and then put the living room over in this corner <clears throat> I don't know what we would do here we'd be having windows here TV could go on this wall couch could at least go here. Could do a slightly bigger couch as well. Could do like a three with a chair. And still have a table there. Maybe that's what we'll do. Maybe we'll make this the dining room. If we, we could do a sectional in this area, but we could just do a couch, space, 
TV, their windows here. <coughs> yeah. Okay, let's take a... Oh wait, no, there's a piece right here. A piece of the sectional. for the dining room as well. We'll see. We shall see what it looks like. Mm, one window? Okay, so new, so I like these island ones. I was gonna start the kitchen like here. It's a long kitchen. I could make it shorter, it doesn't have to be the entire length. Like we could do like a bar, like a coffee bar thing over here. And then this is the dining room, because I wanted this to start here. So we could actually put the fridge. Like there doesn't actually look bad. Could also do like a separate little coffee bar here. Could do something else like a buffet table there with like some wine on it or something. But for now, <clears throat> so let's say the kitchen ends like there. It's not a very big kitchen, right? I think we should have one more. It's either that or the fridge will go over here. <laughs> <coughs> also, let's get the dining room table and stuff out. We only have two beds, so we could have like four people here, so we don't need a huge dining room table. 
Also doesn't have to be super expensive. I also really like the farmhouse tables. Like these are really big though. I do really like them. But okay, let's go for something smaller. No, that's too bulky. No, it's super retro looking. Oh, I actually like this table because it's smaller than the farmhouse table. It's a drafting table though. Not a big deal. It fits all the people we need. Okay, come on. Really? Okay, so we'd probably put it like here. I don't know if that's the table I want yet, but <clears throat> it's okay, Lulu. It's alright, baby. What's this look like? Oh, super beachy. No, it's okay. <coughs> we might change the um. Ah, oh, we could just use a katatsu. I do love katatsus. Oh wow. I wish I wish we could like shrink this down and use it properly. This farmhouse table is so goddamn big. Ow. Mm, I really like the farmhouse table, it's my favorite. Well, we could also use it's basically same size. Yeah, it is. Is this the same size? It is. I do like the idea of using glass and then you can see kind of like what's underneath it, like the carpet that we're gonna put there. Also it is more modern. Uh, I might change the cabinets because the, those don't have matching upper cabinets. <laughs> and I want them to be sleeker. Okay, I might just do this table, actually. Glass table. Okay, now... <clears throat> I haven't painted the walls or anything yet. <coughs> Sorry guys, I need to drink more water. Um, I'm thinking... The type of chairs I want, they're gonna- I'm trying to go for modern, so like, these are super nice, and I love the blue, but I just don't like the bottoms of the chairs. <laughs> I don't like the bottoms. So, my next favorite chair is usually like this one. It's not- I, I mean- it's, they're nice chairs, but they're not like super modern feeling. Hmm. I mean, they're more modern than a lot of the other ones here. I mean, this is super modern. I'm not particularly a fan of these ones though. They're kind of ugly. Also, there's no blue. This is a nice color though. It's a leather chair. Ugh. That's also why I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like leather chairs in general. Um. Ah, uh, this is the other one I was thinking of. I'm not sure blue is really gonna go with like the dining area, but you know, it's just thinking of oh, uh, like some dark, rich color. <clears throat> like I would do green, but it's it's kind of light. So I feel like the dark blue is nice. Let's put them down. Um, there's only gonna be like four people living here, but you know, you have guests over sometimes, need some extra chairs, you know? I'm just not sure if that's overkill. 
Welcome! Bree Bear, hello! Thank you so much for the follow on the PlayStation and on Twitch. I appreciate it. How are you doing? Mmm. Actually, the green kind of... The green kind of flows better. It's also because this giant wall is just so empty. We'll fix that. I wonder if the Sims will... Would it be better to do like a round table? Hmm. I don't know. Oh, that's too much. I'm not entirely sure, you guys. Is that overkill? I feel like a round table would be better suited here. I also feel weird putting the dining room like as soon as you walk into the house and you're like in the dining room. It feels weird. This was gonna be over here. And there would definitely have been enough space over here and then I was gonna do like a hutch. Hmm. I'm so indecisive! Somebody help me! Oh god. Also, I'm not keeping the couch and stuff pink, I'm just, you know, I was just doing that for color, so it wasn't white. Jealousy, you're still here, hi! <coughs> I'm sorry. It looks nice, you're welcome, and I'm doing good, how about you? I'm doing good, thanks. Um, <clears throat> just dehydrated. <laughs> I'm gonna drink some more water. I brought the whole jug of water in here. So I got tired of going to the fridge every, I don't know, hour. <laughs> but thank you for saying it looks nice. <clears throat> I struggle when it's a small area. Most of my houses are huge with wide open areas and not really tight confined spaces like this. But because it's part of the challenge I'm doing um, I'm doing a build Newcrest challenge uh, for Sims Grown on Facebook and right now they said to build like three apartment style suites so I s instead of an apartment like a lot of people are doing like two floors with apartments I'm doing townhouses instead and as you know or as a lot of people will know Townhouses are very narrow. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. So I'm struggling a little bit, but... It's fun, and I'm enjoying it, so I can't complain. Can't complain, can't complain. <coughs> I also think if these couches were this green, it might look nicer. Or it might be too much green. I'm not sure what color I want the couches yet. I don't even know what color I want the walls yet. All I know is, <clears throat> I don't think we can put a- I mean, maybe we could put a, this tiny living table there. Maybe. Oh, that's where the other chair went. <laughs> um... Let's make this green as well for now. <coughs> Pardon me, you guys. I'm so sorry for coughing in your ear. Yeah, like if we did the tiny living table, the round one, it might be okay there. Um... I mean, it doesn't look terrible, it just doesn't look that good. Okay, yeah, let's look at the tables real quick. I have not looked at a single table because I know the coffee tables are not going to be able to fit here. I also wanted to put a fireplace, but it's very small. So, <clears throat> a fireplace is a little out of the question, I think. 
because look how freaking huge it is. <laughs> Even the one I wanted, this one, it's still, it's not humongous, but in a tiny place like this it is. I figured I could probably put it in the bedroom. Like this would be the bedroom. And this would be the bedroom. I figure I could put it probably in one or both of the bedrooms instead. And then downstairs you just have your TV and stuff. Either that or you could also put the fireplace like in the dining room. Something like that. Oh god. Sorry guys, my PlayStation decides to act up sometimes. But anyways, yeah, I'm not really sure. Like, I really wanted to put a fireplace in here and... I don't know if that's gonna... if it's gonna work. But anyways, let's take a look at the tiny living table. It's a round little table. <clears throat> We're gonna put some plants and some artwork on the walls to like... make it nicer in here. Um, and then I'll figure out what color I want the walls after. So right now we're just kind of filling in, filling in stuff for the moment. Yeah, like this little table we could probably put here. I wonder if that's too close to the couch for the Sims or the chairs. Do you think that's too close? Kind of matches the wood in there as well. What if we just did all wood? It's kind of the wrong color wood. It's like a reddish wood. One's too light. Well, I'd also throw a carpet down. I'm not sure. Like, uh, the Sims will be able to walk by this. I know that. But now you can't put any, like, gaming stuff here. <clears throat> like the electronics, I wanted to put the uh, the gaming stuff here, but I don't think we can do that right now. I wanted to put something here. <clears throat> put this. Shrink it down a little bit. And put that there. Okay, now we're gonna. suited to this table. Nah. Let's... Also, the less surfaces Sims have to put their garbage on, the better. <laughs> Am I right? Uh, it's so big! The, the flames, like, do not... <laughs> Do not sit where they're supposed to. <laughs> oh god. There we go. Have a nice little glow. I actually like how this just looks so clean. Like running with the floor and then you have the kitchen here. It just looks so clean. This looks so clean and I love it. Nah, I liked it smaller. 
I feel like I don't like this black tray. Maybe it is blue, brown. Hell, even the green is better. What is the first one I used? I think it was this one. Yeah, I like the green books. However, I do like the multicolor too with the red and the yellow. Kinda like that. The teal. There's not really anything teal in here. The yellow is nice though. That's a nice little pop of color. <clears throat> Can we put stuff on the shelf? Didn't think so. Eh, it was worth a shot. Yeah, I kind of like that better, honestly. It's because the desk is so light. Yeah, I like that. Okay, so I kind of like this couch setup now. After not looking at it for a little while. <coughs> hmm. Okay, carpet. <coughs> carpet, carpet. I'm just gonna... Oh, right, I forgot. <clears throat> I'm also going to just put, like, speakers on the wall. I'm not gonna actually put a stereo in. Because we don't really have room for a stereo unless I put it on, like, the kitchen counter. <clears throat> oh, right, it's this tiny little carpet. Although this would be, like, super cute here. Maybe not black, but... Maybe these are too busy, actually. Teal is so nice. <coughs> Pardon me, you guys. Um, okay, let's take- ay, ay, ay. Sorry. It's like going all over the place. Um, let's take a look at the other carpets. God, I can't believe it's- I've been streaming for four hours, that's crazy. Usually I stream a lot longer, but when I'm this tired, like... <sighs> Oops, surprised. I haven't slept in three days, I'm surprised I haven't passed out on stream yet. <laughs> no, no, I would quit before that happened, but... I've been worried of, about it happening before. Hey, would this look nice? Oh, this is big. Ugh, I feel like I want a colored carpet. Oh yeah, the Dream Home Decorator carpets! Oh, they're so pretty! These are colorful. Okay, so maybe not this exact carpet, and also, let's pull that out. <coughs> but let's take a look. Ooh, that looks kinda nice, actually. Probably with the black table. Although there's not really much red in here. This is also really nice, because it has the green. Let's just do wood. This is such the wrong color. It's a lighter color. It's nicer. 
I like this carpet. This color, I mean. There's green. There's a vibrant. It's like fall colors. The yellow is nice. It's kind of a color we don't have in here yet. You know, I was going for modern and clean lines. This carpet doesn't really do that. I love the carpet, but doesn't doesn't really do that. So let's look again, shall we? <laughs> <coughs> Pardon me. My god, you guys, I'm so sorry. That's not exactly clean lines either. Oops. Yeah, no. I think just a solid. Just. No. Not what I wanted to click. There we go. Okay. Is this solid? It is a solid. Uh, I mean, it has some design on it. It's yet to be seen if it's too much. Uh, why do I always default to this carpet? Oh, I love this carpet. It's too small here, though. Too small! No. Doesn't this carpet have... Yeah, they have some plain ones. What is this? Oh, it's like little flowers on it. Oh, that's cute. Oh. I don't think I've ever seen this carpet before. I mean, like, this particular one. It's like the same color as the table. Interesting. Ooh, purple! Ooh, that looks really good with the green. And the white table. Wow. I mean, I know green and purple look good together, but I didn't think about that. I don't know if this is the right green that goes with it, but I like it. Hmm. I like it. Yeah, I like it better with the white table. Hmm. White table, yeah. Hmm. Well, okay, I guess we're gonna leave that carpet there for now. So, I think I'm going to change these counters because they don't have, like, upper cabinets. And I might get rid of this and put the farmhouse table here. Just do black seating. I don't know. <coughs> Ooh, that purple is really nice. I'm not really one to use purple, but now that I put that carpet down and it's kind of like really nice. It's either purple or this blue. <clears throat> or black, I guess. It's like magenta. That's magenta. That's purple. Oh, so nice. Okay, so let's see. If it's too close to the door. Okay, that's centered. 
like a way that's centered in this room away from the kitchen area so we can put some other stuff here also I'm not sure I like this bathroom anymore I want to change it but not today not today not sure what the color scheme is here. We're definitely going to do a backsplash that's colorful. So even if these are plain walls, which they likely will be, so that we can put colorful art on them, we will at least have, <clears throat> um, we will at least have, um, like colorful ba backsplash and kind of like the middle of the house running over here, which is going to also be plain. And then we're going to have upper cabinets, and then <coughs> we can't do any um, windows or anything. We're going to stick our grill right out here. <coughs> Probably put the grill like right here. Um, or right there to be nice to our neighbors. We haven't even done upstairs yet, although I should actually put these walls in. So don't forget. So, okay, so basically what I was thinking was that would be the bathroom. It'd be a large bathroom. And then the right side would be a bedroom. Left side would be a bedroom. Come on, controller. Okay, it's gonna be a big bathroom with two doors on either end. It's gonna be a Jack and Jill bathroom. Okay. Um, let's just see. Doors. Nope, actually, let's save it. Because I realized I haven't saved in a little while, so I should probably do that. Should probably do that, you know. Come on, controller. Or, hello. There we go. Yes. Alright, okay. So I just want to see like what doors should we use? Um, I'm thinking... Like I really liked the sliding doors if I'm completely honest. The sliding doors. The ones that are downstairs. On the bathroom door. Where is it? Oh my god, it's right in front of me. <laughs> um, so we have different colors, so we could do that on either side, or just put one door directly in the middle. Honestly, I think the one door might be easier for the bathroom, for the sake of Jack and Jill bathroom. So... Let's do a white door. Yeah, I like that. Okay, so one. Okay, sorry. I'm gonna move this. Okay, so we have our Jack and Jill bathroom, bathroom doors, 
Uh, so I think you figured out the gaming issue for my streams. It doesn't want me to have a cam and the game in the same scene. Chelsea, remember when I told you your computer is not strong enough <clears throat> to run all those extra things that you have? <laughs> That's what I was talking about. Because my laptop runs stuff, right? But if I had a camera, it would just slow everything down. So try it without your camera. See what happens. You might also have to get rid of some of the like animated overlays just for the sake of gaming streaming. And you might be able to actually stream Sims again. Like if you have animated overlays of any sort, uh, you might want to get rid of those and then do two separate overlays, like one for ones that's static and one that's animated. Uh, if you have any animated ones. Uh, and then that should help a lot. Also, I think I sent you... I don't remember actually, but I'm pretty sure I sent you some settings that will help uh, run games better. Hi, Lulu. Uh, so maybe... Yeah, I thought they were all static, but I wanted to just like, you know, just make sure. <coughs> um, this. There we go. And then we're gonna do door. Also there. Uh, yeah, okay, yeah, I did. Yeah, so those settings should help you with running games as well, on top of getting rid of your camera. That should be... They should be able to run with that. They should be. Uh, I can pr I can just send it to you again if you want instead, so you don't have to, like, go looking through everything again. Also, Tasha, I did see your comment, sorry, I was just in a... lost in my train of thought. Uh, you're still here, you had to run an errand for your mom. Okay, no worries, son. That's fine. Now that it's daylight, I'm probably gonna go to bed. <laughs> Isn't that just, like, messed up? Now, now that it's daylight, I'm probably gonna just go to bed now, you know? No, I haven't slept really in three days, so it's like... It's mainly because, um, anxiety and stuff, so... I, uh, I, I tried to sleep literally last night at like 7 p.m. Before shoddy stream, even. And I couldn't. And then so, because uh, I couldn't sleep, I joined shoddy stream. Which helped to pass time, but then I was like, I can't do anything! So yeah, it was just, meh. It was... Just not good times, man. Just not good times. Just not able to sleep. That sucks. But oh well. You know. It is what it is. Uh, as long as I don't have the cam in the one scene, it seems to work. Do I do a test stream and see? Yeah, do a test stream, yep. Um. I'm sure uh, Tasha can help you right now if she's free. I'm assuming she's free because she's here. <laughs> but yeah, do a test stream. Um, also, oh yeah, are your headphones still messed up? Yeah, you'll help. <laughs> okay, I'm just like volunteering Tasha to go help you. <laughs> I'm such a nice friend. But I mean, I'm like, I'm just assuming. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Such an asshole. <laughs> uh, God, what's wrong with me? I, that that's a long ass answer. I can't even. I can't even answer that because it's long. <laughs> Hopefully, everything will work. Um. Oh, sorry, Chelsea, your headphones, are they still messed up? Like, are they still broken, by the way? That's what I was trying to get at. 
before I forget. Oh, I don't know if I... maybe... What color should I do this? White? Yeah, white. It's too small of an area. Yeah, that's, that's good. If there's no alert box or chat, that's better for your games. Oh, you got new ones? Okay, good. So then they should work a lot better too. So they should be able to talk properly without it um, getting all messed up and whatnot. So that's exciting. I'm super excited for that. <coughs> Maybe then you can stream some Phasmo and some Sims and stuff. And maybe then you can. Okay, Jack and Jill bathroom. We're gonna give you a nice ass bathtub. Yeah, I'm excited. Let me know how the test stream goes. Um, yeah, by the way, if you don't hear from me until like 10 p.m., then, uh, you know I've passed the fuck out. <laughs> yeah. I, I love this bath tube, this bath tube, this bath tube. Love this bath tube. You know what? That's stupid to put the doors right in the middle. Why don't I put them both at the bottom? Then I can put the shower up here. Here. <coughs> You'll do it. <coughs> I'm dying. <coughs> Sorry. You'll do it within the next 45 minutes, you said? Okay, that's cool. 45 minutes. This is a shitty shower. We should give you a better one. I mean, the best one is the ugliest one. I hate this shower. Why does the best shower have to look like a piece of shit? Like, honestly. I hate tiles in the shower. Why? Why? Why does it have to look like that? Why can't it look nicer? That one looks like from outer space. Like, why can't it just basically look like this one? Like, this looks much nicer than that one. But this one's a lot crappier. Even when it's fully upgraded, it's not that good. It's so annoying. Mm -hmm. Well. Well, well, well. Also, this one does singing skill, which is pretty cool. Singing skill. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna go with this this shower. Um. Orange. No. No, no, no. Ow. Is the color mint green on the bottom there? I don't know. I'm so tired, I'm seeing things, you guys. Help! Okay, cool. I don't think this bathtub really suits in here now. Actually, I lied. Black. It can be black. I like it. Okay, and now we're gonna put the toilet here. So let's move the doors. <laughs> 
<coughs> Let's move the doors here. Mm. Probably won't interfere. Toilet there, and then vanity here. Late toilet, anybody? Um, same as downstairs. Okay, and now we're going to do two counters in the middle. Ooh, I just got an idea. Come on, counters, fuck off. Work! Okay, what if we do it this way? What if we put a wall right in the middle? And we did one counter there. And one counter there. With the wall in the middle, they both have sinks and they both have mirrors. Does that make sense? Because then they have their own vanity with their own stuff and they don't have to worry about sharing. Or the other person, like, getting into their stuff by accident. Boop. Okay, hold on. We're gonna have to readjust those in a second. Excuse me. Fuck off. Stupid controller. I thought about doing two water closets. But, no. Uh, excuse me? So like that, basically. So when they walk in, first thing they see is themselves, because it's going to be a mirror. And then they have their bathroom. It's so goddamn dark there. Weird. God, everything takes so long. I'm gonna probably use different lights in this bathroom. Come on. Holy shit, sometime today. Fuck. It's the most annoying fucking thing about playing on the PlayStation. Everything takes five million years to load. Jesus Christ. Actually, I know. <laughs> Sorry guys, I just get super fucking impatient with this thing sometimes. It's like... Why are you so fucking annoying? press the wrong button, then everything goes to shit. Okay, it's illuminated. Now we need our sinks. I don't know if I like this. I might change it later. But for now, that's the way it's gonna stay. I could've just done double sink. Like right next to each other, but that's fine. This is kind of nice. What do you think? Silly? Should just be flat on the wall? Like two here with a mirror there? Hmm. Hmm. 
Sorry, I was just thinking of something. So... Oh, my little baby. Hi. My little pumpkin. My little pumpkin. She's snoring. Oh. My little boo boos. Okay. So this is gonna be a room. Ouch. <coughs> I'm just gonna use the same floor upstairs. bathroom but for now I'm just gonna put this in here okay so oh. yeah that's fine there whatever okay bedrooms <clears throat> I'm wondering if I should do like one with two beds and then one with one double bed not sure could also um, do the bunk bed thing. Like this. Has a double bed and a single. Well, I was gonna do it on this wall, but that's where the windows are gonna be. So, I guess we'll do it there. <coughs> Pardon me. <coughs> um, I'm gonna put exercise equipment on this balcony. deck, I mean. Okay, so what if we did... Half tile. Half tile. There we go. Uh, on either side of the bed. I think we need smaller windows there. But the these balconies, I was thinking about doing. I'm not sure if I'm going to, but I'm going to test them right now and see if they look good. Okay, so the bedroom. Basically, that's where it would be. On all three. And these windows would be here again. Mm. 
If we don't do this, then we can just do whatever we want. Okay, so I have to turn it to day so I can see what the hell it looks like. So, kind of looks like two doors there with the balconies. And then the doors downstairs. Hmm. I don't know, it's hard to tell until you like do the whole thing. So I'm just gonna do the whole thing. If I don't like it, I'm just gonna put windows there. And I might do like the pergola thing all the way across to kind of break up the bottom from the top up here and just do windows up here. We'll see. We shall see. Uh, does it can interfere with it? Not really. I can't tell if that's like even or not. Like height wise. It's like just above it. Yeah, it is. Okay. Okay, let's try one more. And then we'll do the windows and we'll see if we like the way it looks. If not, we either will make a balcony for each bedroom that actually works. And not just this faux balcony for looks. Or do something completely different altogether. <coughs> Because it's basically what it looks like on the front, except it's right here. They're there. And these ones are up more. So I guess we shall see, won't we? Oops. Go down. Overlap them a little bit more, but that's fine. And it kind of gives the illusion of like a door as well from the inside. See, once they're all filled with stuff, it'll look it'll look better. Yeah, we're probably gonna put plants on those. I'm not sure if I like them on the back, if I'm completely honest. So I think these are a little bit taller. That's because we have the platform here. And those balconies couldn't go lower. actually called awning or not. Ah, it is. <coughs> <coughs> oh 
god, it's huge! See, I was like, oh, I could just build like a pergola. I'm like, oh wait, don't we have these awnings? It's huge though. It's legit huge. It would literally go in the bushes. I don't even think it fits. But it does, it's four. That's crazy. Can you fucking camera, like, stop being stupid. Oh my god. Cause at that, at least, if we put the... Okay, I just want to see what this looks like. Probably gonna look really stupid, but you know. Let's take, let's take a look, shall we? Yeah. So. a little bit out. Mm. It's like... Mm, I guess it's about the same. <clears throat> I think maybe those hedges are out a bit more. Yeah, these hedges are out. That's why it looked weird. These are supposed to be more in a line. looks really dumb. Just gonna say that right now. But hey! At least if you put um, stuff out here, you know, like workout equipment and whatever, it's not gonna get wrecked. <laughs> like, yeah. No. Uh, I thought maybe, but no. <sighs> I'm not sure about this. I'm not sure about these fake balconies on the back. Okay, well. Inside the house we go. Side. I like this. I like that. Yeah, I think I can't look at this anymore. So I think it's decent for now. I might work on this more off stream and then work some more on stream later, but for now. I think I'm done. I think I'm done. I'm super tired and it's 8 a.m. and I haven't slept in three days, so I'm probably gonna sleep for like 12 hours. Oh! If that's the case, I'm really screwed up my schedule. <sighs> okay, let's see. Is there anybody on that we can do a raid for? Can we do a raid? Uh, let's see. Uh, okay, we're gonna exit to main menu. Okay, who's online right now? Uh, 
Oh, I know. Okay, we're gonna do a raid. Raid! Here's our raid message, everybody. Perfect. Alright guys, thank you so much for tonight. It has been a lot of fun. Bree Bear, thank you for the follow. Lintwin, thank you for the follow. Lotus, thank you for the follow. Totoro and Hundreds, thank you so much for the follow. Um, everybody who's been here, thank you so much for hanging out and chatting. I really love and appreciate you guys. And I will be back maybe not tonight with some more games, because I'm super tired. But definitely this weekend, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, I will be streaming. So, have a wonderful night. Please copy our raid message if you are still in chat. And we're going to go give the lovely Sphere Arcana a little raid to show our love back to her. Because she's a wonderful, amazing human being. And if you're not already following her, you absolutely should be. And she's also streaming Sims right now. So everybody, have a great uh, rest of your day or night, whatever it is, and we shall see you all later. Bye!